Ah, the Red Hot Chili Peppers, huh? It's uh, Friday. Opie and Anthony, thanks for checking us out. This is a busy show. Uh, we're going to have more audio of Jill talking about you in a few minutes. Why? What happened? Uh, that's just breaking right now. Is that- just breaking right now. They're cutting it up down the hall. Also, uh, more on Balloon Boy, the Iron Sheik. He's got some questions to answer today, my friends. Allegations, Allegations of, of what? Child molestation by another wrestler. And some uh, crack smoking. Yeah. Also, uh, there was something else, something else. Oh, yeah, Big A and Bobo are going to be coming in in a minute or two. Okay, good. Um, Sorry, I'm, my last bite of my bagel. It's all right. It's all fucking right. Mm-hmm. We found something out about Bobo, a new one, a new tick he has. If you say anything that's true to Bobo, he'll go, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. So we want to see how many times we can get him to say, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. What's an example? Like, you ask him. Uh, hey, Bobo, are you a Mets fan? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Do you like Christina? Yeah, that's right. Or I should be saying you like Christina. Yeah, all right. Yeah, that's right. Right, okay. And every time we get him to do that, we'll hit the the old bell so you can play along at home. You can uh, even Steve you can Bay- even ring a fake bell if you're in yeah. your car, like ding. Steve from Bay Show saying, hey, Bobo, you got fucked by your brother. Yeah, yeah that's, that's right. right. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> he doesn't know we're saying this right now, so. No. He's, because as soon as he... he he's is in a, a soundproof booth. Well, as soon as he's aware of a bit, you know, he's so smart that he just, like, blows the bit. He wrecks it. He tries to do it too hard. Right. Uh, uh, Puddle of AIDS writes, it's Jocktober. I don't even know if we're going to get to Jocktober today. Uh, he writes, the Light FM 106.7 here in New York City. Question of the day. Ready for this question of the day? A big radio station here in New York City. Don't just, even tell me. It's just asked. That question. It's not, unfortunately. Oh, that would have been a good one. Yeah. Uh, After a breakup, what's the number one thing <laughs> right. that uh, 99% of the people do? Uh, burn. Burn, burn, burn clothing. Clothing in a fire pit <laughs> while the guy that's supposed to protect the man is videotaping it. <laughs> yes, that was a correct answer. <laughs> Puddle of AIDS. Uh, this question was just asked on a big radio station. Mm. Women do this once a week, but dread it. Hmm. We're not giving dread the answer. It. I'm not mm. giving the fucking answer. Let me think. Um, I'm not giving the fucking answer. I could give a shit. Yeah. Uh, Tickle their uh, clit with a rake. What? <laughs> Tickle their clit with a rake. <laughs> I, uh, we should get Bobo and Big A in here. Is Bobo ready to go? Ah, uh, Big A. In like a minute. I think he's just wrapping up with Derek in production right now. What are they doing in production? Anything good? Probably. <laughs> it's probably. Know, isn't it always? When, when Derek sits in a room for eight hours a day with no windows, you yeah. always get something good. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> well, we got Big A, too. Deep boy. Ready to do the news. Uh, Big A is lumbering down the hallway right now. Wow. When he walks down the hall, he walks down the hall wall to wall. He is just a big man. And, uh, wow, look at Bobo. We haven't seen him in such a long time. Yeah. Get Bobo in here first. Hi. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Bobo. It's uh, Bobo. He's Hi, got Bobo. A, uh, let, me, let me just uh, describe um, what we're looking at here. Bobo has... A uh, hat on. It's a serious uh, little doggy hat that has a uh, NASCAR uh, flag, uh, you know, the old finish line flag in its mouth. And then we're looking, you have a race collection, uh, Gordon 24 performance leader DuPont uh, shirt. I guess that's Jeff Gordon. Yeah, yeah, that's correct. That you, That's correct. Uh, anything on the back of that shirt? No, there's Just nothing on the back. Picture. There, there, there's nothing on the back of the shirt. Black <laughs> jeans or something? Yeah, yeah, those are black jeans. And uh, white uh, sneakers. So that is what Bobo looks like. And, of course, his patented Bobo glasses. And, Bobo, uh, you're a Mets fan. Y- yeah, that's right. Thing. Uh... Mm. Yeah. Um, now, uh, wow, a Mets fan. That's got to suck. So you're a Mets fan? Yeah, that, yeah, that's right. I, uh, I, I don't, I don't even look at the playoffs when they don't make it. Right. Really, you're not going to watch the Yankees? That's terrible. No, no I'll, 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 gl- I'll glance, I'll, I'll watch the game. But if I'm, but if there's something else I want to watch on at the same time, I'll, uh, I'll watch that instead, instead of, instead of DVR it oh. at the same time. Well, you're from New York. I, I, I do, I do pay attention are to the game. From, are you from New York? 
Yeah, I do. I, oh. I, I, I do. <laughs> I do pay it. attention to the games. I'm not and if, 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 if I got, uh, if I got, if I got a yeah, friend whoa. of mine, if, if there's a friend of mine that, a friend of mine that maybe some friends that are Yankee fans, I, I've congratulated them when they've won the series. Bobo, yeah. so you are a NASCAR fan. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. All right, mm -hmm. NASCAR fan. And is Jeff Gordon uh, your favorite? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. I've, I've actually attended uh, two races already. Oh, you have? Yeah, Homestead in 1999, first race at the Homestead Miami Speedway. Yeah. And Bobo, you have a sister. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, she has a dog? Yeah, she has a dog. Oh, all right. So, okay. Uh -huh. And you live in Queens. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Uh -huh. Well, we're just trying to get some of this out there for the listeners that haven't heard you yet. You know, you're a big star, but there's still a lot of people that don't know yeah, go a much about you. Yeah, biography. Yeah. And you have a major crush on Christina? Yeah, 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 that, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. I even invited her to go with me to, to see uh, Jimmy at the Stress Factory in November. Oh, is she going to go with you? Well, she said, "Let her let her know the day the days." Wait, 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 wait! You're saying that you asked her on a date to see Jim Norton at the Stress Factory? Yeah. Mm. Okay. Uh, well, wow. well, I, I know she likes Jimmy, and I know she enjoys Jimmy's comedy. Who doesn't? And you like Jimmy? Yeah, of course. Jimmy's great. Oh, oh okay. Mm -hmm. And is it true uh, your uncle works at the Queens Motor Inn? Yes, that's right. He works in a Queens Motor, but unfortunately, uh, he's not sure he can get he can get discounts or anything like oh. that. I, I I asked I asked my uncle. I fig I figured that that that's why I, I actually and invite invite that that's why I remember that time I said that about Christina. That I bring well, her out to the yeah, Queens yeah, Motor. Yeah, 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 remember that? Yeah. I. What happened mm. was I I asked my uncle. Can he get me a discount? He says, "Oh, I'm not sure sure about that." Right, right, right. He right. could get me a discount. I was thinking maybe he could get me some kind of discount uh -huh. since he works since he works there. You think he would? And with all the exposure on the show, you're getting recognized now. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That, that's uh, right. I, I've got it. I've got it stopped on the on the subway. Uh huh. I think once I got I got stopped on uh I forgot uh, around around my block of my one of my one of my neighbors knows. Realized I was on the show. You're getting recognized in your neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, exactly. There's actually mm. someone in my neighborhood that actually knows me. That, did, that I, knows me from the show. From the show? Yeah. Have you been recognized at a Mets game? Yeah, I I have been. Uh huh. Yeah. Do you wear anything uh, that people would like recognize you for? Or they just know you from your voice. And sometimes they sometimes they seem. Sometimes I think I don't, I don't know. Like one person heard my voice. Then maybe I was wearing I was wearing a I was wearing a, a serious hoodie one time. Now you always wear Mets uh, logo stuff, right? Uh, not all the time. There's at the a game, lot, I mean. A, at the game, of course. Oh. At the game, of course. <laughs> I suck at this. <laughs> <laughs> well, we haven't seen you in a while, Bobo. Yeah, yeah. It's been a while. It's been a while, right? Yep. Uh, Tim in Boston, what's up? I want to tell Bobo how compelling. He is on the radio, and how much I, I just love it when he comes on and yeah, the show great. Yeah, you really do a good job for us, uh, Bobo. All right, that's good to know. And we thank you. All right. Someone's saying if you wear a shirt that says "Hi, I'm Bobo," <laughs> that would be uh, pretty silly. <laughs> and yeah. are you are you uh, fighting with a fake Bobo on Twitter? Yeah, there is a fake Bobo. Oh, a guy oh. that says right. "I am the." Too. There's a guy that says "I am the real Bobo" on Twitter. Uh oh. So what I'm gonna do to finally give him some good proof that that Mr. Met Eight in fact is the real Bobo, I am gonna tweet a picture of me actually on Twitter, and they'll see a, a, evidence of me in front of the screen. Hopefully, with right. th th they'll see like evidence that I voted. So, that so to help you out, if uh, if people are following you on Twitter, I am the real Bobo. You're gonna have a picture of yourself, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. My Twitter account is Mister Met Eight. Oh, that's the fake guy. So you're I am. The, well, you're obviously I am the real Bobo. No, no, no I am the real Bobo is a fake. Is a fake imposter. But he says I am I'm the, the real, real Bobo. Bobo. So that's got to be the real Bobo. Yeah, he, and he's he, got a picture of himself. Yeah, and he's got he, a picture. He, is he, it, he, and a wow, you. and a wow logo, which means that's, that's yeah, 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 but that's that, that, be that, you. that guy took my. That guy stole my picture. You're lying. 
I'm not. Li- I'm not lying. No, you are lying. I'm not lying. Because that's what celebrities do. They say I am the real, and then whoever it is yeah. Yeah, just to yeah, prove yeah. to everybody that exactly. they're the real yeah. celebrity and not yeah. the fake celebrity. Twitter yeah, but account. the thing is, they got. So, re- that's good. Th- yeah, but the thing is, they got to remember there was all- before when I first o- opened that Twitter account. What? When I first opened my Twitter account, I did not. There was only one person that knew me as Bobo at the time. Oh, and who was that? That was my sister. Your, your sister. sister calls you Bobo? She was the only one who knew me by that name. Does your sister call you Bobo? Yeah, she does. She's called me oh, that since she was a baby. Well, it's pretty smart that you you, you got a new account and says I'm the real Bobo. That, 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 puts a, that puts an end to the whole I, I, you know, actually, that's controversy. Not, that, that, that's not you are even, over. You won, my friend. That, I am the real Bobo. That, we got to promote the that, shit that, out of that. That, that. that That's not even my Twitter that, account. That, 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 who the heck is this imposter that's been putting up this stuff well, on uh, Mr. Met 8? Yeah. No, 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 no. Mr. Met 8 We're is have actually it all my Twitter. Out today, though, which is good. So. No, no, Mr. Met 8 is actually my Twitter account. Yeah. Yeah. All right. M- M- Mr. Met 8? Yeah, yeah, that's my Twitter account. Oh, so oh, I understand. A lot of people have two Twitter accounts, so that's when yeah. you're just talking Met shit, but for all the other Bobo stuff, I am the real Bobo. No, no, I got it. We're, we're no, all set. Now. No, there's a guy. There's all a, right, let's bring Big A in here. Uh, thank you, Bobo. That's great. You're going to help us out with the news today, Bobo? Yeah, I am. All right. You, you got some opinions on Balloon Boy and all that? Yeah, I... I all I, right. I, save it for when we get to that story, my friend. And here he is, ladies Big and a, gentlemen. Good to see the diet's working, uh, my brother. Big A. Big A in studio. It's been a while. How are you, Big A? Oh, hi, Opie. Not yeah. bad. Yeah. Hi, Anthony. How you doing? Hi. Very, very well. Uh, okay. Good to see you again. See you um, too again. Nice to have you here in the studio. It's been quite a while. What have, what have you been up to? Uh, just working and, and hanging out. Nothing much. Yeah, I just working, is, hanging out. I what is, you... as Bobo, but I try. Yeah. Ah, what, so what have you been doing? How have you been hanging out? Where have you been going? And uh... um, um, Not too many places. So I work at night, so I really, it cuts my hanging out time. Now you find time about like F.H. Riley's, though. I appreciate that, my friend. I see you tweeting about F.H. Mm. Probably S- appreciates still it. Still driving the cab? Uh, 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 yes, but the business is real slow. So. <laughs> business is slow, huh? Yeah. Why is that? Uh, I guess, you know, uh, bad financials. What? Was breathing like that. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> you Those big that? juicy lips of Bobo. <laughs> He's trying to Bobo get in. Bobo is breathing like. What's a wrong fucking... with your breathing? I thought it was Big A, but it's definitely Bobo. Like the not, fucking T Rex. I don't think. I don't think I'm breathing heavy. But I can hear it in the microphone. Yeah, I heard. Yeah. That. 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 That just. That's just my nose. Here. I'm quiet. <laughs> it's your nose hairs? No, it's my nose. It's, it's, it was breathing through my nose. Oh, well, I heard it on the on the mic. <laughs> very, very, fu- very funny. I, uh, I didn't even realize I was breathing that heavy. Very funny. Oh, it's, not very it's, funny. It's, this thing damn picks up everything. What, that big hunker of yours? No, no, this thing <laughs> picks up just even the slightest breathing. What what thing? Oh, the microphone. Yeah. Very sensitive. Yeah, very sensitive. So, Big A, uh, what uh, uh, th- that cab thing, how do people get it? Do they hail you? Do they hold up their hand and go, taxi? Actually, they call my company. The oh. company dispatches out the calls. And uh, you're not getting that many calls? Uh, I've been kind of slow. Yeah? Lately, yeah. yeah and making ends meet, though? Yeah. Paying the yeah. bills? Able to pay the bills? Yeah, just barely, yeah. Just barely. Yeah. Are you going to find another job? Um, uh, I was thinking about it, about how many jobs out there, because uh, a lot of people are losing their jobs all over the place. Right, right, right. So Obama will help you. Yeah. Obama will <laughs> help you. He's going to give you a handout. You're, yeah. you're an Obama supporter, right? <laughs> no, huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! He's, he's just laughing. He's just giggling. You don't man. like Obama? Is it because he's a uh, a uh, you know 
you know, a Democrat. Yeah. <laughs> maybe you could go <laughs> down to the uh, maybe you could go down to the UN and become a, a translator. Yeah, that could be possible. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> maybe I'll translate you Iron Sheik. Oh, you know? are you guys fans of the Iron Sheik? <laughs> yeah, of course. I always. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. He, 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 that guy brings so much entertaining moments to the show. He's been on our show twice in two years. <laughs> yeah, but during but during those during those two times, he's always yeah. He, he, the, the guy's always an entertaining character. My brother does a good impersonation of the sheik. Oh, does he? It's quality, not quantity, right, Bobo? Yep, that's right. <laughs> that's right. I'm with you. Yep. All right. Mm. You want to do the news with uh, Big A? Sure, no problem. You guys can move to the big table. Just don't sit down, so we can see you better. Move the chairs out of the way, too. We haven't done uh, Big A news in a while, right, Big A? It's been quite a while. A long fucking time. How's this going to work? Big A's going to do the stories, and I think Bobo's going to do the commentary. Because, Bobo, we noticed you could you could riff off, off the off the cuff. Yeah, off the cuff. You just go. You you hear a story, and you know how to just take oh, it yeah. and uh, give your opinion on it. Yep, yep that's right. We I just noticed that recently there, there's this balloon boy. Well, we're not doing it yet, Bobo. <laughs> See, we're just setting up the fact that wait. you're right. really good at just, you know, coming up with commentary right. when, it, when it comes to these big news stories. So how, this is how it's going to work, Bobo. Big A reads the news story, and then you're the commentator, and you, then you give your opinions on it, all right? All right. All right. Here we go. Oh, yes, Danny. Assignment, I'm sorry. I did give Bobo an assignment. I don't know if he... Uh... I don't know if he completed that assignment, but I did have uh, attempt to have him write some stories of his own. Oh, did you write stories of your own, Bobo? I, I was actually doing it at the same time they they called they called they called me for something. Oh, you didn't do it last night. Didn't do your homework. No, I just did today. I didn't. They they just asked me. They just asked Ball-gated. me to do it today. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll see how you do. Let's start uh, with the news. It's Big A and Bobo with the news. Go ahead, Big A. Okay, uh, stop the presses. <laughs> Big A is back with news and more um, stupendous. Than ever. That's not. On. On. i around here and get right to the news. A 40 year old woman says she is an abortion addict. And has had a, 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 um, 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 she's just eight that she would stop taking her breath um, um, patrol pills and get pregnant. Um, she would get excited and then panicked because she wanted a husband 
Satan to 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 stay with her so she would get an abortion. Um, she also says that she tried, you know, to st- oh my God. <laughs> st- st- up, up her, um, her own life several times during her marriage. Uh, 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 during her marriage. <laughs> Bobo, what is your... St- uh, st- Answer on this. Uh, <coughs> yes, Bobo. And, and talk about a, sui- a suicidal wife. I'm sure. I'm shocked. What the heck's gonna happen if he, if, if, if the, if the. I can only imagine what kind of crazy stuff. I guess maybe he could divorce and not have to worry about it because she'll commit suicide eventually. Suicide. <laughs> suicide. No. Su- suicide. This is just. Oh my God, this is horrendous. <laughs> Abominable. I can't even. Holy shit. Yeah, that's. Suicide. Suicide. Terrific, yeah. Bobo. Thank you for that. Oh my God. <laughs> Do we all need to take a breath? Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Uh, what's the next story there, uh, big guy? Do we have another? We have another story. Um, 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 um television. Station in Washington is cutting costs by training the newscasters. Uh, 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 to work their own <laughs> teletype machines. Yeah. Um, um, the newscasters will use a series of hand uh, levers and foot pedals. Uh, some uh, 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 some uh, uh, um, some staff members at the at the station are worried that the new system could increase the chances for on-air blunders and 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 humbles. This, 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 will begin training the new casters um, soon. Uh, Bobo, your, uh, your take on this yeah, story? Yeah, this is a big one. I, I wouldn't be surprised if you see any of them uh, re- react like uh, Ron Burgundy, right, like uh, Will Ferrell in the movie Anger Man, the, the guy that he would read. Anger Man. Anger Man. Anger Man. Anger Man. He m- m- anger remember how yes, we got Steve C. Yes. Anger Man. He's Anger Man. <laughs> anger Man. <laughs> Suicide and Anger Man. <laughs> anger Man. Right on, Bobo. Right on. Continue. Oh, right. You like that movie, Anger Man? I liked it. Yeah, yeah. I thought, thought I didn't it like fun. it at first, but the more I see I, it, I appreciate I, Anger Man more I, and more. I thought it was. I thought it was funny. I wouldn't be surprised if someone ends up doing what what Will what Will Ferrell's character did every world, time. World. <laughs> What's a Whirl Ferrell? Whirl Ferrell in Anger Man. <laughs> he, 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 the, the guy, the guy would read. The guy would read it. If there was a mistake on a teleprompter, he would read it. I wouldn't be surprised if you, you'd see people reading teleprompter mistakes on air. Like Whirl Ferrell in Anger Man. Right, right. Like if, like if someone accidentally put like. You just just mis- misworded something like mis- misspelled something. Oh, who would they, they do would, that? They would read it. They would read it like that on the teleprompter. Yeah. That... Is that what you got? That's pretty good commentary. This is why you're in here today, Bobo. Yeah. I like how you think off the cuff. Mm-hmm. You're very good at improving. I'll yeah, tell you that you much. Just mm-hmm. nail it. Big A, what do you got on Balloon Boy? Okay, us, us, 
Krass. 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 Hit him in the back. Krass. Krass. Trend. Nation. Yeah. Um. 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 He's sweating. Wow. You got this. Big A, you got this. Go ahead. Um, 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 uh, uh, don't worry about it. It's just the early version of the AOL. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? what do you mean, Bubba? No, no, because no, I mean it feels like a di it feels like those dial-up connections when you're waiting and waiting. Oh, okay. But, so he, he's, he's great at commentary and off the cuff. That improv. Bobo is amazing <laughs> off the cuff. That improv. Back to Big A on Balloon Boy. Um. Oh. <laughs> I think this is probably be the word that shuts me down. Holy shit. Um, holy. You got this, Big A. You got this. Just read what's in front of you. Oh, man. Oh, he's sweating. Oh, <laughs> Holy shit. Come on, Big A, you got this. Oh, nations. Nations. <laughs> Bobo's breathing heavy into the mic. And then Bobo. Come on, big guy, you got I this. Can't fucking... A stunned nation. What? What happened? Um. Us. Uh mm huh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fuck. You got this. Patience. <laughs> Like trying to turn over a car in the cold weather. Yeah, <laughs> a, a, a stunned nation. What? Uh huh. Fuck. Oh my God. Sound it out. Sound it out. A stunned nation. Mm -hmm. Nations. That's good to know. That yeah. vein popping out of the top of your head is amazing. It's like fucking watching scanners. Oh, yeah. All right. Uh, Stun Nation stood. Oh. Oh. 
אז... אז... looking around the room for help yeah there's not a stun nation stood You got through medium and hard. Now you're on expert. We got to yeah. get with yeah. you now. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, they're Big A. You got it. They're calling him Big Z. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 he's going for water. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Walter oh, Cronkite never went for water when he was doing oh, his wow. newscast. <laughs> yeah, a stun nation stood... Uh, Still, okay. Still, still got it. There's only seven more of these words yeah. to go, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> yesterday, as it's... Oh. A as it's... As it... All right, you're you're right, Big Gay. What's the matter? You're right. You're yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. You're breathing heavy. You're drinking water. It's a simple story. The like, whole uh, country's talking about this. It's like exercise. Yeah. You're just working uh, up a sweat. Uh, uh, not easy, Anthony. No, I. Not I, I, easy I, I, I could see. Yeah, it's weird. It's weird how not easy this is. Let let her rip. They're now. yelling at Danny for doing a. <laughs> Trifecta, trifecta of ST words. <laughs> well, I think next time we do this bit, we should weigh Big A before the news <laughs> and, and then weigh him again <laughs> after the news to <laughs> see if he loses a pound or two from sweating. I'm, I'm trying to film this, but my arm's getting tired. Yeah, I gotta, yeah. I gotta put my arm down soon. All right, what happened, Big A? Uh, 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 as it's. <laughs> People are yelling on the phone. It's stunned. It's stunned, you idiot. <laughs> All right, go ahead, big guy. As it's... <laughs> it's something you do all the time. Yeah. <laughs> you got it. You want me to give... Uh, I'll give you one word. You get one pass. You want a pass? Yes. All right, he wants a pass, Anthony. A stunned nation stood still yesterday as it stalked. Continue. A helium. Um, I'm a helium field. Field. Balloon. I'm supposedly carrying. I'm talking. Um, uh, 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 um, talking team. Okay. The boys, uh, father. All right. Buckle in. Um, 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 I built the, um, I built the balloon for a weather experiment. After the nation's media watched this balloon, oh, no. 
um, um, head, 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 father. Um, um, head, father. This, 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 Oh my God! Wow. Um, the attention. <laughs> the attentions. The attentions. Carved parents. Aided in the interviews, as this was not us, 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 stupid, us, um, um, stunt. Whoa! Wow! Damn, yo! And there you have it, Bobo. What do you got on that story? I have to say that whole balloon was a big. That whole balloon story was a big letdown. Especially, I can't believe how the news wasted their time on that coverage. And there was nobody inside the balloon all this time. This guy's at home. This this kid's at home, and there's nothing in the balloon. And they're making it look like oh, there's a kid inside the balloon, and there wasn't. That's not really commentary. That's yeah. that 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 kid wouldn't have even survived had had he been in that balloon. Why? Yeah. That. A drop that high? I don't think anyone could survive a drop that high in in a, in a balloon it, it like that. It came down very soft. Yeah, but that, but from what I heard, but from what I heard from my uncle who served who served in the military, told me that a kid wouldn't be able to survive a drop that high like but, that on but, that kind of balloon. But the balloon came down very softly. We saw it come down softly. Yeah, but there was there was no one no, there was there was no there was no one inside it. And and obviously there wasn't any any like way that that if thing I don't know I guess maybe there was some some maybe some kind of restraints or something that maybe the kid should w w probably would have forgotten to to wear if they, they, let's just say the guy was playing around with the, the kid was playing around with the balloon and wound up in the balloon but didn't really know anything because he's six years old <laughs> the, the guy the, that that kid would have uh, probably not not survived right. Oh, fuck. All right, there you go. There's your commentary from Bobo and Big A with the big news story of the day. Holy shit. That is amazing. That's wow. just amazing. I got to say, Big A, um, yes, it's been a while. Never, never saw you have so much trouble before. Are you a little more nervous today being here? What What, what do you think uh, attributed to the, the difficulty factor in, in reading that those news stories? Um... Uh, maybe, hold on. And I also did a, a small little promo, but um, I mean, I don't know. For some reason, I locked up bad today. You locked up bad, bad today. yeah. Look at his shirt; he's sweating. I, I, you I think, right? I think G gimbal I, lock. Yeah. <laughs> I think I think his brain upgrade upgraded to Vista's. What happened? Oh, oh wow! Oh, oh my Bo -bo. god! Bo -bo. And let's go to the phone. And say hi to Dave in Tennessee. Dave. Hey. Good morning, guys. Good morning, hey, Dave. Dave. Better give the medics uh, a call because I think he might be having a stroke. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't know the difference if he was. No. How would no. you know? He probably would That's start talking really normal. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Let's go to Walker in Texas. Walker. What's up? Hey, Walker. Hey, man. i got to take up a donation plate to get this dude some on phonics. Son of a bitch. He was struggling so bad that I got nervous going into work. Yeah, that... I I'm sweating like a whore in church right now. Yeah, you know what? I'm sweating. Look, it's, that sweat yeah, marks yeah, all over me, it, too. It, it just I don't gets, know what it is, but it makes you start sweating. It's it hot in it's here. Really hot. And you kind it of find bad. yourself, like, not breathing as much. Yeah. You start taking, like, yeah. just little shallow breaths. Yeah, it's very difficult to yeah. uh, watch. Let's go to Ted in Hillborough. Ted? Morning, boys. Hey, Ted. When I, uh... When I heard him stutter and I went in and ordered an egg sandwich at the deli, I came out, he was still on the same word. <laughs> <laughs> Later. All right. Uh, let's go to Nick in Brooklyn. Nick? That was fucking excruciating. Oh, my God. 
I can't believe you guys made us listen to that for that long. Well, we don't make you listen to anything, Nick, and, if you and, think about it. And look, uh, reading the stories, it should have been... Ten you know, seconds. Nothing. Yeah. I don't know what... Uh, the... Yeah, it should have been, but now my fucking ears hurt. I'm nauseous. I don't know what to do, and they just ruined my whole day. All right. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Let's go to Blind Dave in Massachusetts. Blind Dave. That was gold. Uh... Perhaps Big A could supplement his income uh, reading letters and mail for the blind. <laughs> ah, there you go. What about that? You read letters and mail th uh, for the, uh, to the blind? <laughs> you know, be wonderful. Someone. <laughs> that was worse. For the people that have been with us uh, for a long time, that was the worst one ever. Yeah. By yeah. far. Yes. I was, Gold. I was filming. I had to give up at 10 minutes, and he was on the same story. Uh, Anthony, someone, I, I would love to give him credit. Mm -hmm. They want us to do a uh, version of uh, Cash Cab with Big A. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Can you imagine? That's a good one. Let's go to Don in <laughs> Vegas. Don. That Don on the phone. You motherfuckers. I am up 10 hours drinking playing poker, hop in my car, get ready for work, and I think my fucking radio is broken because all I hear is, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> I am about ready to throw this fucking thing out the window, search for my warranty, about ready to call serious support until I realize that fucking retard yeah. is just out there stuttering. Well, he's not and retarded. It just my whole morning up. He's very smart. He just he has a problem uh, communicating. Hard getting and, from the brain out, yeah. out the mouth. No, he just has a problem, problem with the ST words, if you haven't figured that out. Let's yeah. go to uh, Matt and Punaki. Matt and Punaki. Stop stereotyping stammering stars, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Frank in Southampton. Frank. Yeah, those two guys are killing me, man. That's, that's what happens when your mother smokes crack till the, the ninth month, and then you get black semen all that time as well. Jeez. Oh, boy. Big A, you want to comment? Uh, hell. He's kind of calling you retarded. You got something for this guy there, Frank in Southampton? Actually, actually Frank, you know... I'm not retarded. Oh, shit. Yeah, big A. A big A. I was actually rely on you to, to convey that uh, news story to me, because since I haven't heard anything about it, it was so painful my stomach hurts now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Thank you, sir. Let's go to Billy in Arkansas. Billy? Hey, I just want to say that I appreciate what Big A is doing, because... Uh, in my job, I work out in the field, and I'm in and out of my truck all the time, and I have to work it around. I try to work around what's going on with you guys, and uh, I've got a lot done this morning. Oh, good. Yeah, I just wanted to say, you know, I knew I wasn't going to miss much, so I got it done. <laughs> all right. Thank you, sir. You bet. All right. Uh, all right. Well, I think they did a great job, Big A and uh, and Bobo. We're going to step aside and get the Iron Sheik in here finally? Oh, please. You guys want to hang around for the Iron Sheik? Sure. Yeah, that's Big right. fans, Bobo, yeah? Sure. Sure? Yeah, it'd be an honor to meet, to meet the, le the legendary Iron Sheik whose appearances have been legends on this show. <laughs> um, um, legend or legendary? No, no, I meant his appearances have been legendary on the show. Uh, I'm going to commit suicide. <laughs> I'm going to get really anchor soon. <laughs> yeah, anchor. <laughs> oh. Anger man. Anger man. Whirl, whirl feral in anger man. <laughs> and sewer side. Sewer side. I think we got one more bit for Bobo. I think Sam's gonna is working on something. But yes, Big A. What do you got? I think... Uh, you want to promote your appearance on the Ron no, Fed no, show? No, 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 no. I think this proves <laughs> Mr. Met A... Is Bobo because because he's tweeting um, uh, 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 um, um, spelling is as atrocious on the tweets as it is on there. Oh, oh well, that damn. might be the bit we're doing. Well, damn, yo. Well, well, I, well, I have to admit the computer that I've been using is atrocious as the spelling. Atrocious, atrocious, atrocious. as the spelling. The, the, the computer my mom has, my mom freaking can't afford a. A high speed connection, so it's it's freaking dial up half the time. Dial up. Dial up. Who has dial up oh, anymore? Well, well my poor well, people have don't have dial up. Well, well, my mom, well, my mother does. But why? Anyone can get a, a regular, you know, cable. Uh, I don't. Or something. I don't know. She's always thinking there's these hidden charges and stuff. Yeah, and how does a bad computer make you spell wrong? Well, the computer is slow. It doesn't respond quick enough. Uh, quick enough for your fast 
great spelling and typing. Oh, and, it's and, just and, synapse and, that doesn't respond quickly. Enough. Yeah. And, and in other words, <laughs> if you type yeah. something quick, quick enough, sometimes most computers will respond quick enough. This does not respond quick enough. Okay. It, it really, All like, right. you probably right. need uh, a okay. magnifying glass. Right. <laughs> but we'll try spelling something on my computer, because mine works. Yeah. It's on di It's on uh, high-speed uh, yeah, high speed. Yeah, what do you want him to spell? Uh, Let's give him an, uh, an easy word. Uh, no, you give you You're the real Bo Bob. He just spelled Bo Bob. <laughs> I am the real Bobo is a is a face. <laughs> is a, is a, a fake. I'm the real Bobo is a fake, but you wrote face oh. first. Okay. Well, I was, able, I was able to correct microphones, it quickly. Bobo. Yeah, microphones. I was able to correct. I was I <laughs> yeah. was able to correct it quickly because because it respond quicker. My my computer would have took it for well, it would have took it a lot longer to type that. Would have taken a lot longer. But typing stuff into Word doesn't matter whether you're on a dial-up or a high-speed connection. Yeah, it's yeah, just... yeah, yeah, that's right. But but for some reason the internet connection. <laughs> back to that, by the way. The, the, <laughs> it, for some reason Twitter you, doesn't Bubba, you're lying. doesn't doesn't no, respond uh, quickly lying, on my Bubba. mother's computer. You're lying. I'm not I'm not lying. All right, Larry oh. King's checking in. Aunt. Larry. Big A. How important is the frontal lobe? <laughs> <laughs> and then we got Joe in Queens. Joe. Yeah, I thought Anthony had the best imitation, but Big A, you you get kudos for the best imitation of buffering video I've ever heard. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> buffering. Yeah, you do impressions. Hey, you know what? The nation was stunned yesterday. So, Bobo, why don't you spell stunned for everybody on Danny's computer? No excuses. You don't have the dial-up. Here's Bobo spelling. Can we make it big so we could all see it? So we could all zee it. We got a zee it. All right. The nation was, there you go, stooned. <laughs> <laughs> the nation was stooned. Well, I admit that, that too, that too, that too, and I, I, I depend on spell check. What, right, I, what, what I actually started doing yesterday <laughs> is I started running Word at the same time I'm running stoned. Twitter. All right. Uh, uh, spell this. Bitch. There's, there was also another story here well, what, um, how about, about a 40-year-old woman. Uh, All right, get it. You're on. Uh, I'm sorry. How about um, you spell abortion? Oh yeah, that's good. Yeah, we did uh, that story about an hour ago. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, very good. Oh yes, abortoron. A b o r t o r o n. <laughs> no, that oh, was right. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> okay, that's right. better. No, All right, you're yeah, on. Go something. ahead. He's respelling. All right, A B A R T S T I O N. Abortion. A borch, a borstian, a borstian. That's when you spill borscht on the floor. <laughs> I admit, I, I depend on spell check. All right, why don't we do a very easy one? Just yeah. spell balloon. It's everywhere. It's probably on eight, uh, all eight of our TVs yeah. right now. Go ahead. This is an easy one. We'll give you an easy one, Bobo, because I think they're fucking with you. Uh huh. B a l l o n. Come on. It goes backwards. Come on. Uh, all right. B a l l o o o n. <laughs> Balloon. All right. B a l l o o o n. But before that, he said B a l l o i n. Balloon. Right. Balloon. Big A. Give him a word to spell. Something in the news. Something I don't know. Show related. What do you got? Um. Um, 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 how about F.H. Riley's? F.H. Riley's? <laughs> F.H. part, I mean. Yeah, I mean, it's got the, uh... I, I'll make it bigger, yeah. Yeah, we gotta make that bigger, yeah. There we go. See. All right, F.H. he's got so far. Mm -hmm. Capital F, lowercase h. <laughs> All right, and he's got the F.H. right. R. A. I. L. L. Y. Very oh, good. Yeah. <laughs> With the <laughs> F H Rally F H Rallies. But but, but even the apostrophe S has It's not an apostrophe, it's a quotation, quotation mark. Quotation mark S. S. One more, weather. Because it was a weather yeah, yeah. balloon yesterday. Here we go. Oh, oh shit. damn! God you actually damn. nailed you that one. Be fucking kidding me! Well, why? nailed it. Yes, up, big A. Uh, 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 yes, I want to um, uh, uh, help uh, um, to promote on uh, uh, November seventh. Weird Medicine is going to be live. 
Ah, yes. Uh, yes. You know what, so, Bubba? You should try and spell weird medicine. That's a very good idea. Who hosts for wait Dr. A Steve? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry. Um, well, he's... All right, all hold right. on. He's got the... All right, weird. W-E-R-I-D. Medicine. M-E-D-I-C-E-N. Very yeah. good. Weird <laughs> Medican. <laughs> Well, yeah. Well, well, I admit, back it, back it. As a matter of fact, back in the day before I started using computers a lot, I would actually, I actually had to depend on a dictionary for spell check, and it took me a lot longer back in the day. Yeah, but now it's not so bad. Um, oh, yes, Big A, Big A, I'm... Big A. Could you please tell us the host of Weird Medicine? Mm -hmm. Um, uh, doctors, uh, um, doctors. Um, Dr. Um, Dr. Steve. Ah, yes. Dr. Steve. Wait, what? Um, Dr. Um, I didn't hear you because I was, I was looking at my phone. What was that again? Um, Dr. Um, Dr. Steve. Yes, Dr. Dr. Steve. Steve, indeed. All right. I look forward to uh, Weird Medicine with Dr. Steve. Yeah, All exactly. Right. Should we take a break and get uh, the Iron Sheik Jesus in here? Jesus Christ. Yeah, take a break, get the Iron Sheik. Needs to be sponged off. Yeah. <laughs> Someone, Someone hose, give him a, hose a sponge him down. bath or something. My God. Bobo, good job. Big A, good job. Hang around. Maybe you could ask uh, the Iron Sheik a couple questions, okay? All right. All right, quick break, and we'll uh, do the Iron Sheik thing next. Opie and Anthony. Hey, what's up, guys? Opie and Anthony. Iron Sheik making his way down the hall. This could take uh, a while. The here whole gang. I think we got a bushwhacker and a... Uh, who else? Who else, Ant? We had a bushwhacker and Iron I, Sheik. Do you think I even know? <laughs> or give a shit? Oh, my God. What are they doing? They're walking slow. Like, this isn't an entrance to a fucking boxing oh, they're match. they're walking slow because they're old. Well, Iron Sheik's got a cane now. He didn't have a cane last time. No, is that one of the and that's bushwhackers? His, where's the bushwhacker guy? I don't know. I don't know who these people are. Oh, they're working their way in. Iron Sheik, yeah, he's smiling. He just saw us for the first oh time. Oh, my God. What can I do to occupy my hands? I don't want to shake his hand. I know. We, we don't shake. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Right. Iron Sheik. Ah, uh, there he Making is. Making his big return to the Opie and Anthony please, show. Please, please have a seat, gentlemen. Yes, sir. Yeah, they are. How you doing? What's, What's up, sir? Up sir, are you a bushwhacker? No, I no. Am a Who are you? Look like a bushwhacker. Bush I don't know. Who's the? Oh, that is a bushwhacker. Oh, I know the bushwhacker guy. No, no, get out of here. You can, you can lick Sam's head. Bushwhacker, lick uh, hey, Sam's head. Does it taste like sardines, mate? Yeah, go ahead. Can you lick sardines. his? Can you lick his head for us? Like the old days? All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We got a bushwhacker. We got Iron Sheik. Who else is in the studio? From, uh, one of the demolitions. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. That's all right. Come on. I'm sorry about that, Remember sir. That's all right. I like the get-ups you guys had. That, that fucking costume. Yeah. The demolition? Yeah. Yeah, you did all right. Do you yeah, every so oh, often yeah, to pop that thing on? Uh, you guys yeah. remember? <laughs> you guys remember talking to the mics? That would be really, uh, oh, really helpful. Oh, the mics? Yeah, there you go. Right. Talking to the are. mic like you're, like you're doing a... There. And, of course, the Iron Sheik. A promo or something. Now, Iron Sheik. <clears throat> yes, sir. Finally making his uh, appearance back to the Opie and Anthony show. What do you have to say about that? Oh, I'm pleasure. Always anytime, Anthony. Pleasure. I hope you need me. I'll be happy to hope be you. here. You're happy yes. to be here. Happy yeah. to be here. Uh, and, of course, uh, the Iron Sheik's representation. Mm -hmm. uh, for some reason, he always brings his lawyer with him or something. Yeah, that's really It ain't no BS with ESS, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, <yeah. laughs> Do you want me to punch him or should yeah, you know, I think we should Oh, you're on our side? <laughs> that's good to know. Right. I think we should all just all right, kick the him. The demolition guy is on our side. That's good to know. Bushwagger, what side are you on? Us? Uh, our side? On your side, mate. You don't like our Sheik, right? <laughs> all the way. All the way. All the way. I nigh. Now, mate. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's finish up uh, some old business, Iron Sheik. Yes, Last time Iron you were Sheik. here. You, you peed your pants, and then you did a you did a blog and and uh, yelled and screamed that you did not pee your pants. So you want to set set the record straight today? 
Absolutely. I didn't just have a smile. The beer fell down and by accidentally I didn't ah, pay my penny. It yes, fell sir. down your throat into your bladder and then <laughs> out your penis. And out your pee hole. <laughs> and how do you explain the uh, the wet spots slowly but surely getting bigger as the appearance continued? The wicking effect, yeah. Opie. It was a wicking effect. Oh, really? Yeah, it spread out everything. All right. I want to get to the allegations. All right. Why don't you take, uh, take that one in? I just want to get to the allegations. Um, well, now, who who is making these um, allegations? Uh, Brian uh, Blair. Uh, Brian, you know Brian Blair, right? Well, absolutely, yes, sir. Yes. Do you know what Brian Blair has said about you, sir? Well, you know, many years. What are you talking about? You want to talk or I talk? No, you talk. Oh, yeah, we so, want. We don't want to hear from the dumb lawyer. Yeah. We want, we want yeah, to hear from our own. You know, that, that, guy. that douchebag, too many years that have bothered me, and all of a sudden, he come back with some kind of bullshit talking. But all intelligent, my wrestling friends and all the wrestlers, they know. Uh, I grew up with the sport, and... Um, at the University of Minnesota, I'm not the kind of person to he talk bad about me, but and uh, and uh, I saw a story. If, if he said that something bad about me behind me, I can say he. Uh, one day I go in the locker room, I saw Hulk Hogan was behind him, um, and I wash his back and fuck his ass <laughs> to make him humble. So and that day, uh, if you want to say that, uh, I can I can say that one too. So right. I, yeah, you could say, well, do so, we, I think we have a clip, don't we? We, we sure do, but uh, is he saying that Hulk Hogan fucked yes. Brian Blair in the ass? He said Hulk Hogan <laughs> fucked <laughs> Brian Blair in the ass. Absolutely, because <laughs> all, all days, anywhere we go, we saw the name of the Hulk Hogan and Brian Blair <laughs> on the locker room. Always they go same locker room. Oh. Uh, and, and I was Cincinnati, Ohio, and both of them go same room. And after much, I saw that uh, and uh, to Hulk Hogan. Uh, was behind him uh, and killing his fucking boss and fuck his ass. <laughs> so, I mean, uh, the, the jabroni douchebag come and try to make a bad name about me. I can say that one too. Wow. All right, wh why don't we go around the room, Anthony? Uh, yeah. Demolition, what do you yeah. think of that, those allegations that Hulk Hogan was fucking <laughs> Boy, I'll tell you in what, the if locker the, room? If, you know, uh, that's unbelievable. But yeah, you, know, yeah. you could trust what the Sheik says. Yes. Really? Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, the Sheik's honest. And Bush I, said, it, I it. said it was Sheik said it's in, it's in the rock. That's it. Uh, yeah, okay. And, That's uh, it. and the lawyer is uh, Iron Sheik being accurate about Hulk Hogan fucking Brian Blair in the ass in the locker room. What do you think? <laughs> I, wasn't, I wasn't there, but uh, if the Sheik said it, you know. Yeah. yeah. And you want to get to the audio. Now, yeah, I would love to get to the audio now of what Brian Blair had said of yeah. the allegations he's made against the Iron Sheik. All right, uh, listen very closely. strong. Very strong, very horrible allegations, Iron Cheek, that he's made against you. you That's why I say that douchebag many years probably tried to get even with me because I fuck his ass so bad, he gets so bigger and stinky now, tried to get even with me. Go ahead. Okay. All right, yeah. Listen close. Listen close. Here we go. As the years went on, Cosro would not stop. I mean, the drugs, the uh, steroids, the workouts, and then I found out that I could not believe that he had a young boy, a ring boy, in, a, in the room, a guy that wanted to be in, in the ring crew or something. And I hear this. At uh, first, I smelled pot in the hallway. And I'm smelling this pot, and it leads me to the door, and I'm listening. And I hear the sheik's voice, and I hear this little, uh, like a lower tone voice. And... Uh, uh, Sheik molested this little kid in the room. Wow. Uh, Iron, Iron Sheik, Sheik to how you. do you respond? He said you were molesting a young boy in a room after smoking marijuana in the, the same room. You know, all my friends in pro wrestling know since I'm America, I never do that shit. I'm a really religious man, honest man. But that douchebag wants to get even with me mm -hmm. because everybody saw it in the Silver Dome, Pontiac, Michigan, 93,000 people. I had him in the camel clutch. I was ready to break his back and fuck his ass, make him humble. <laughs> Hacksaw Jim Duggan, come save him. So I ah, want to say... fucking Hacksaw. No, right. No, no, I want to say if he's a man enough 
And if you think I'm like Michael Jackson, half <laughs> and half, uh, God bless Michael Jackson. He's gone, but I'm surviving. Anytime you think I'm half and half like Michael Jackson, he can bring his buddy Hulk Hogan or Huxley Jim Duggan. Anytime, anywhere, uh, it's not too hard to find me. And I'm going to be in Nicola, and I'm going to show that son of a bitch piece of garbage who is a, who is a real man, who is a half man. He is absolutely, I saw him with Hulk Hogan, he's a half man, not me. So he's uh, because of uh, his yeah. because of his sexual uh, intercourse, his sodomy <laughs> with Hulk Hogan, as you put it, uh, that makes him half man. Absolutely, absolutely. absolutely. Okay, and and the lawyer, how could? Uh... Brian Blair know what's going on through a door, staying on the other side of the door. I was thinking the same thing. It's like he heard. Well, he some smelled voices. the marijuana, right? Uh, that led him to the door, but he, he heard. He voices. heard it from the outside yeah. of the door. I guess some type of noise, but yet he comes with this thing saying that Sheik was doing some some gay act, which you know, yeah. If you notice, Sheik, you know, he ain't gay. I, I think uh, Brian yeah. Blair and the Sheik got to get together here and talk over this. Don't yeah, you yeah, think? I think they Demolition. should. Uh, yeah. Well, they got together at the roast last year, yeah. and you know what happened? She humbled them right at the roast. You, I, boom! You I, fucked I, him in the ass? I, sla uh, <laughs> I slap his I face. I should. I slap his fucking face until you get the you get the message. But you know, uh, as long as we, I cannot fuck his ass, better I had this fucking uh, slap his face and he get the message. But everybody know I'm I'm a, I'm a real man and I'm a grandfather. I'm a, yeah. uh, you know married man and that bullshit doesn't match me. But he wanted to try to get even with me and he make a, a new story about that. But Brambler. Anytime you think I'm a half man, you bring your buddy Hulk Hogan or Hackster Jim Duggan, I bring Nicola. Anytime you want to steal, I can take you down and put you in the camel clutch and fuck your ass, make you humble. Have a good day. <laughs> Have a good day. <laughs> right. that's, uh, that, that, that's it. All the, and all you were probably doing was probably teaching the ring boys some of your moves. <laughs> so there was a lot of grunting and groaning going on in the room, maybe. Yeah. Not really, no, because I didn't, <laughs> I didn't have no I can assure money. you there's nothing that goes on in the hotel in the hotel rooms. Oh, really? Trust me. Well, uh, with that said, there's part two to the allegations oh, here. Sure. One more clip from Brian Blair. Right. And Sheik's turned into a... Uh, he's one of the guys that I will tell you that I think is a, a, not a good person. Oh. And not only did... Uh, 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 I remember the first time when we were going to Australia, Sheik uh, had popcorn and uh, walked through the thing, and I'm going to sleep here, and all of a sudden I smelled something funny, and they had crack rocks at the bottom of this popcorn. Uh, him and uh, a deceased friend, good friend, uh, junkyard dog, God bless him. And here these guys are smoking crack on the airplane, and I can't freaking believe this. I mean, I really can't believe this. And Wow, now he's saying you smoked the crack there, uh, Iron Sheik. That's a bunch of bullshit. I have a lot of respect for my company to have flow overseas. I don't do that stuff. I just say, that guy is a sick. He tried to get even with me, make that bullshit story. Mm. But uh, all my wrestling fans, all my intelligent wrestling fans, and, and all the boys, they know... I'm a man, 100%, not half and half. No. Not a half. And, and not half. smoking the crack. Absolutely. No crack, no, no crack no, drugs, no, no. no crack it, boys' it, ass, that, nothing. That, that doesn't match the All-American A, <laughs> no. you when University of Minnesota coach. <laughs> that, that doesn't match me. I need to try to make a bullshit story to maybe get the sympathy with people. But that doesn't work. Brown Blair, I see your fucking jabroni douchebag anytime you want. Like I said, I bring Nicola, you bring your buddy Hulk Hogan, and we're going to find out who's the half and half. Now, uh, gentlemen, um, you see the, the Sheik just always in some kind of fucking conflict with, with other people yeah. um, from the past and everything. Like he's, the Sheik won't let shit from 92 go. You know, from like the 90, early 90s and 80s and stuff. You guys hold any grudges with any uh, people? I can't say I do at all. No? I get along with everybody. Yeah, see that? <laughs> Look at that. He has a nice guy. <laughs> yeah. see, I love you guys. Iron Sheik just talks about what a nice guy he is, but he's constantly fucking people in the ass. Yeah. Yeah. And you're just sitting there going, I ain't got no problem with anyone. <laughs> right. I had a great career. This is fun, you know. It's an easier way to live, right? Exactly. Demolition. And when, Having when, no problems with anyone. Yeah. 
And then and Iron Sheik, there's allegations of smoking crack. And oh, my God. Oh, with his never boys. controversy. Never. This you is know. just a bullshit he made it. Bullshit. But, uh, but, exactly. But he's a politician. Why would he say something yeah, like that? Yeah, what kind of fucking politician is he? He beat the fuck out of his son. You have to go into jail. You call that a politician, man? <laughs> well, there are rumors that he might have, you know, did some things with his sons. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Was it oh, proven to be true? Because I, I, I heard the rumors. You tell us, Eric, what happened to his son. You can't say it better than me about that. He was accused of um, you know, beating up his son because his uh, son came in late or something, and uh, whatever. So uh, he hit his kid, you know, child abuse type thing. Well, you know, or, that's, there's, there's uh, different levels of that. If yeah. you just give him a little smack, it's called discipline. In this, in, in today's generation, uh, you know, that can, uh, t you know, that can have your kids taken away from you. Really? Mm. What about fucking in the ass, like the Iron Sheik? Mm. Well, some people deserve <laughs> that, but uh, you know. That's the Iron oh. Some people deserve to be humbled, you know? The Iron Sheik is always humbling people. Where's the rock We're supposed to plug the beer that the Iron Sheik is drinking today. What, what is Iron Sheik drinking? I think drinking? he's drinking oh, yeah. uh, Bex. Wonderful uh, Bex. Uh, well, why don't you do the commercial for Bex there, Iron Sheik? Well, you know, I've been in Germany many, many times over there. One of the best beer I had in Germany, Bex, St. Poliger, and it's excellent beer from uh, Germany. I like it. You like it, all right. Yes, sir. All right, just don't pee your pants today, please. Oh, no, not today. I'm not okay. today? You're all right That's today? only a tenth beer so far this morning. Yes, so and, and, of, and, totally of, and of course you have tons of pictures that the uh, Iraq's bothering him to sign uh, to uh, you know, ah, to, to showcase yeah. everything, you know. Yeah, of yeah. course. His, his big mark-out moment, but that's, a, that's okay. We take care of our wrestling fans. It was a great moment when he peed his pants and we all got to mock it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Iron Sheik, moving on to other things. Captain Lou Albano. One of the greats just passed a couple days ago. What? And I, I do believe, if I remember my wrestling history, he uh, I think he managed uh, the Iron Sheik for a little bit, right? He absolutely, many years, one of the greatest managers, him, and also my manager, Mr. Fred Blassi, our good friend. Classy. Uh, Classy. Classy Fred Blassi. Yes. yes. My, my manager, I was his first champion, uh, WWE. And uh, both um, Captain Lou was a good, good man. God bless him. I get along with him, uh, and he was a funny man. And he tell the story over and over, over many times. He was a good man. God bless him. Yeah, yeah. Great loss. Another one. You know, yeah. so many. Exactly. Yeah. So many wrestlers dying of natural causes. It's just amazing. Yeah. Okay. What? <laughs> I said, well, okay. It was fun. <laughs> yeah, we like the golden era of the managers was, is uh, gone, you know? And he was yeah. Mario. Did you like the uh, the rubber band thing he, he sported there, Arnie Yeah, Sheik? he was a, I, I, I like him. He was yeah. a good manager. He was a character. Yeah, a rock character. Yeah, rock and wrestling. Yeah, I'm going to get along with that. The managers were good back then. I mean, they were always jumping in and Absolutely. fucking around with the, the match. No one ever saw it. it yeah. uh, they never saw it there, uh, Never saw the, the the sand in the eyes or the yeah. chair in the back you know, of my head. Here's another you know, one, Mr. Fuji. Mr. Now, Mr. Mr. Fuji, he had a box of tricks at yeah. Fuji. Yeah. I can tell a lot of stories about Fuji. Yeah, but Fuji never cheated. Never no, cheated. never cheated. Uh, never oh, cheated. He never, he never got caught. Never threw salt. No, he never got salt. caught. It's like, oh my God, there's salt in his eyes again. <laughs> and it's like, why isn't anybody looking? Any good rip stories on yeah, uh, I Fuji? Us, I can tell you one back in Puerto Rico with, with a guy called Luke Graham back in the 70s. He got um, Luke lick it up. Luke passed out, dropped he dropped acid in him, took him to a tattooist, got a tattoo on his arm while he was out, and then took him to the airport to pick up his wife and had another girl's name on his... <laughs> oh, <that> was, <laughs> how's that? That was just one of one of Fuji. Another one. The car was parked outside, and he having a bit of trouble with this guy in the dressing room. This is this is a this is the uh, God's honest truth. The guy was getting smart. He had people come and take the guy's car engine out. The guy come out to start his car. Went and lifted the hood up. No engine. No <laughs> engine. A, no engine. What a smart ass. Yeah. Fuji's, <laughs> Fuji's ribs were a bit. <laughs> yeah, well, he's a prankster, right? <laughs> a bit of a prankster. What are you guys? Uh, what are you guys doing in in, uh, in town? Uh, uh, we're in we're in town uh, today, Saturday and Sunday. It's the Big Apple Wizard World Convention. It's over at the Pier ninety four. That's fifty fifth and twelfth Avenue over here in uh, New York City. Um, it's a big uh, pop culture convention going on uh, this weekend. Very, Very cool. Be hanging out there, signing, signing stuff. autographs and stuff all weekend. Today, yeah. tomorrow, and right. Sunday. Nice. A lot of fans come up there. 
<laughs> Want to see the iron chic? Well, and Jesus also Jesus. these two. And well, I've been, of course. I've been saying demolition guy because I don't know if it's Axe Smash or Smash. It is Smash. I'm Smash. sorry. Okay, it is Smash. One of the demo, uh, demolition guys. Uh, Iron Sheik, I'm going to name some other wrestlers. I just want your opinion on them, okay? Uh, we'll start with Razor Ramon. That's Scott Hall. Scott Hall, right. Oh, that fucking jabroni <laughs> <Tirati> <laughs> come steal the show in, in, in my rose. And he was so fucked up uh, with drinking and uh, hard, soft, whatever. And, uh, and it was uh, another day I was really sick about him because... Um, he was so fucked up throughout his daily show, but you know, uh, you tell him what happened. Yeah, he got, he got drunk at the, <laughs> at, so the uh, at the Iron Sheik Roast. That's ringroast.com. And, you know, they got another one coming up. Your good friend Terry Funk next uh, next weekend is the big uh, Terry Funk uh, Legends of the Ring convention over in Monroe, New Jersey. Terry Crown Funk Plaza. is douchebag. Like at, 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 the, at, the, at the last one, you know, uh, one of the comedians was doing his uh, his bit, and he said he made a comment about Owen Hart, and he took, you know, Scott Hall being drunk and took oh, it to Hart and yeah. almost beat the shit out of the comedian and... Uh, had to have a bunch of security guys uh, try to control him, you know. Look, yeah. you know, but if my, if our personal head of security was there, that none of that would have happened. Now, you see that big guy in the yeah, corner over there? Oh, yeah, we don't. Yeah, you know, and he, he hasn't he, cracked a smile. No, yet. He, he doesn't. And he just, you know, he yeah, on command. He does? does what he do, you know. He just stays exactly. there. Yeah, I understand. He's an iron sheik, and sure. he's our head of security over right. here. You know. All right. When yeah. we move on to the next name, I don't think you've ever expressed um, what you think of this next wrestler, Hulk Hogan. Well, you know, I don't have to say everybody know in America. Who was a champion before Hulk Hogan or Sheik? And um, if it wasn't not from chief of the WWF, Mr. McMahon, senior and junior, he never can be the Iron Sheik. Money talk, money walk. So and, uh, I, lost uh, I lost my bet to him. I lost. the bullshit coming. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, Hulk Hogan is um, another guy, a step back, you can't trust him. And. Uh, uh, you know, he's, uh, we're upset that he didn't invite you on the Australia tour coming up. The big uh, Hulkamania Australia tour coming up next month. Uh, you know, he should have invited the Iron uh, Sheik to go to the go on the big Australia tour with uh, with him. Absolutely, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Well, but the Hulk trying to get, uh, get some money that his wife took from him, maybe. Well, probably, you know, you have yeah. a lot of, the, he's fucked up worse than other <laughs> chick now. Uh, and, <laughs> <laughs> the, divorce, the divorce is final now. Uh, uh, wow. <laughs> were you, were you, uh, did you see any of the reality show there, uh, Sheik, where he was uh, getting into all kinds of <laughs> jams with his wife and everything? Not really. I don't. I don't talk about his wife too much. But oh. uh, what about that fucking? Uh, well, because it was on TV. It's not like you know we're talking about it. I don't think she watched the. Rea doesn't watch the reality TV. No, so yeah, I don't. No, I don't, I don't, no, I don't think so. You didn't see the wife fucking the twenty-two-year-old guy or whatever. Yeah, I think his wife not get yeah. more hit than yeah, Hulk yeah the house boy. <laughs> 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 the house boy. Nice. Absolutely. Yes, uh, that's definitely. what he's got on Hulk. What about uh, I don't know the Ultimate Warrior Iron Sheik. Well, he's uh, another fucking uh, <laughs> jackass and uh, gay son of a bitch. Uh, embarrassing for the WWE or WWF to hit me part of um, uh, wrestling uh, sport. And, uh, you know, the guy goes, uh, fuck somebody and uh, somebody fuck his ass for money. Uh, and it's embarrassing for the uh, bushwhacker. It's embarrassing for the demolition to I can be same locker room with that fucking piece of garbage. <laughs> Low life cock suckers to fuck him. He, I mean, embarrassing for my business. Embarrassing. Exactly. Well, Bushwhacker's yeah. nodding his head. Bushwhacker, you got anything on the Ultimate Warrior? Sheik said it all. <laughs> <laughs> what can I, how can I better that? <laughs> something like that? All right. Sheik, were you alleging that perhaps uh, the Ultimate Warrior would uh, take money in exchange for people putting their penis in his asshole? <laughs> He's looking at his lawyer. <laughs> An all-day sucker. <laughs> exactly. 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 All right, that's what uh, the sheik say. We enough. don't know. How about uh, Macho Man Randy Savage? Oh. Uh, Macho. Yeah. Go ahead. Sorry. Macho Man is um. Uh, I don't know. Oh, God bless Elizabeth, but he's another uh, Jew jabroni. Watch the money, uh, and uh, you can't trust him too much. And uh, but uh, but he's not gay. He's not gay. He's a good man. Uh, at least he's not gay. Right. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. He's a good man. I have a lot of respect for uh, Manchester Savage. Better than that fucking Arthur Moore. 
Yeah. What about what about uh, uh, Jesse Ventura? What oh do, what yeah. Do you think about oh, him? Jesse Ventura is a good friend of mine and oh, a yeah? governor. Yeah, governor of the. Well, not anymore. Not anymore. Not anymore. Yeah, no, but he's. Uh, what do you think? The uh, he's, he's still uh, in charge of Iran too. <laughs> he's a good man uh, and. Uh, I know him since I was Minnesota. Yeah. And he made it, and he's all right. He's at least not uh, out gay. for war. Exactly. He's not gay. He, no gay. He's a good man. Uh, I get along with the Jesse. His last match, as a matter of fact, was California, and he had a heart problem. He didn't go in the ring. But uh, Jesse used the brain. He's a good talker, very smart man. I have a lot of respect for Jesse the body. Wow, wow, look at look that. that. You're else? not going to see that a lot well, out of the Sheik. No. Who else do you have a problem with then, Iron Sheik? Did we cover them all? Well, not really. I don't. I don't have any problem with the, none of them except that fucking douchebag Bram Blair. He, yeah. he wants to get even with me you now. After many years, I fuck his ass. His <laughs> ass is so big and stinky. No, I, I, no, I get rid of him. And I get rid of him. No, no, he missed me. I imagine. So I go back against him, fuck his ass, make him humble. Yeah. But no, no more again. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. All right. Exactly. Does he have any other problems with wrestlers, lawyer? Uh, no, just uh, Scott Hall, Ultimate Warrior, Hogan, Blair. Uh, <laughs> That's I it, think. Huh? What about Rowdy? Uh, what, what about Rowdy? Rowdy Piper? Oh, yeah. No, Rowdy. Here, Rowdy. Here, we have it right here. The uh, the loser gets humbled. Old Country Way match. All his uh, oh, nemesis wow. are right right here. Here. Yeah. Yeah. Get that on the camera over there. Exactly. Yeah. Get right. that. Buddy. Are you still wrestling there, Iron Sheik? No, I'm not wrestling only for the autograph section. But if I have to wrestle with them, uh, Bram Blair and Hulk Hogan, yeah, I, I'm, I bring them. Nikola Volkov and myself, talk to many anytime they want, I'm ready. He can go talk to the Kennedy McMahon, son, uh, son counter, no problem. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah, I, <laughs> exactly. Right. Hey, yeah. Bobo, you got a question for the Iron Sheik? Oh, Bobo. Getting ready to wrap up here, but... Uh... Yeah, yeah I, got, I got a question, Sheik. How... How do you think you'd fare if you were around in today's age of today's day and age of wrestling? How would you fare today? Today, what I'm thinking about new generation, what are you talking about? No, no, no. Bobo, rephrase your question. How would how would you fare today? I think he'd do absolutely hey, great. lawyer, shut the fuck yeah, up. Yeah, lawyer, what are you, ruining the bit? We smell a bit here. <laughs> right. We got well, we got the, one moron over here who can't right. tell a question, yeah. and Iron Sheik who can't understand this, <laughs> this uh, idiot. Right. Read the this room, my friend. Read the here. room. <laughs> yeah, uh, still if I won, I can wrap the knee and I go in the ring with the tag team, my tag team championship with my partner. Oh, I think. Uh, 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 no problem. I guess what Bo was saying oh, is if, right. you, if you were wrestling today, who would you want to fuck in the ass? Probably uh, Bram Blair before Hulk Hogan. <laughs> no, no, some of the new wrestlers. Who, who do you have a problem with? Oh, the new wrestlers are get along with all of them. They are good people. Good people. As matter of fact, as matter of fact, I was uh, last week in the um, SmackDown in the Boston, Massachusetts. All the new generation, good people, hard worker, uh, and then. Uh, but I leave it to them. My wrestling friends, they can decide yeah. who's uh, who's a good or who's bad. But it's, uh, the, the way they respect me on the uh, building, uh, I respect all of them. That's because of the T-shirt, and I have a lot of respect right. for the new generation. Well, we're getting a lot of questions coming in, Iron Sheik. Eric uh, writes, Iron Sheik wants to fuck all these guys in the ass, and they're the gay ones. <laughs> Very confused by that. You're calling everyone gay, but you're also saying how you fucked everyone in the ass. Well, to humble uh, That's them. with a uh, beer bottle, not literally fuck them well, in the no, ass. Well, no, he and could, the lawyer ruins the, it again. Just Thank to, you, It's lawyer. to humble them, Opie. Yeah. Uh, big not a. doing it out of gayness. Iron Sheik, this is Big A. He's a big wrestling fan. He wants to ask you a question as well. Here's uh, Big A. Big A, grab the mic and talk to Iron Sheik. Uh, actually, I'm curious. In your opinion, which was the... The best uh, match uh, of you ever in. <laughs> the best match? <laughs> yes. The best Iron match you ever in. This guy is going to be perfect opinion. for the wrestling business. Oh, right? yeah, yeah. Yeah. What a fucking character this guy is. He, he, would be, he would be perfect right in front of a fucking <laughs> camera. Fucking. He wrestles with the English language. <laughs> you guys don't recognize Paul Bearer? We brought him back for <laughs> <to> you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Bearer. <laughs> we found him. Here he is. Percy. What a, what a, what a cartoon yeah. character he is. Jesus yeah, Christ. Well, yeah. You know. Paul Bear, remember that guy? <laughs> Jesus Christ, just like him. He's got another question. Oh, you got another oh, question, Big oh. A. Okay, yes. Yeah, uh, I. Who's your 
favorite of super on super Wait, wait, can you start over? Big A, I was a little confused there. Can you shake a little bit more, please? <laughs> Big A, start over. Can you not shit your pants while you're trying to ask a question? <laughs> oh, oh, please? Okay. Big A will fucking smother you to death. <laughs> you're going to have you, a problem Do you see the guy here. standing behind We're going to have a problem in there here. Ain't gonna, there's nothing oh, yeah. going to happen oh, here. Oh, shit. That guy's pretty hardcore right Does there. Does he ever smile? No, no, I don't allow him to. It's not in the job. See, it's not in the job description. I see you brought some heat. It's our, it's our head of security. You know, I we have that. to keep. Uh, I yeah, see. You that. know, keep the. Right. You know, Big keep a. us uh, protected at all times. Big A, let's go. Dallas Wallace. <laughs> He's still not smiling. <laughs> oh Jesus! Big A, once again, what's the question for the Iron Sheik? I'd like to know his favorite super star in wrestling. Oh, Who, who's your favorite superstar in wrestling? Well, uh, you're talking about old timer was a soldier. Slaughter was a great performer. Mr. Bob Backlund, six years nobody beat him up in the garden. That was good, and uh, very few. But uh, for sure, soldier Slaughter, and um, I have a lot of them. The Malaysian and Bushwager, all my good buddy and good oh, friend. Yeah. I get along with most of them. All right, and I'm I'm hearing Iron Sheik that you're getting back together with your wife. What's that about? Well, you know, I mean, uh, one year, uh, one year uh, I was uh, by myself because she have to drive two hours every day to go for her job. But now she can get back again, and we're together. Everything is okay now. Or what was the problem with him and his wife there? The, the problem, uh, her job was uh, too far from the the host I had, and uh, she uh, moved uh, from me, and now. Uh, She's coming back again, and we're together. Everything is okay. I bet she just didn't like that you were fucking so many stinky asses. <laughs> not really, not. To humble, to now humble that the sheik has gotten somewhat control of his uh, demons, uh, oh, she's, coming, she's, coming, she's coming back. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, demons, huh? He's, uh, is Iron Sheik's really trying to clean up there, huh? He's, uh, no more, no more crack I've cocaine? Seen him. No more crack cocaine. Oh, so you're admitting he did a little crack uh -huh. cocaine. No, he admits uh -huh. that he does that. He admits that he does it, but uh, oh, anybody in the wrestling business knows what the Iron Sheik is about, but uh, we don't have to go there. We don't have to go there. Okay. Yeah. All right. No. And, uh, and what do you think of Iran there? Well, you don't know. Uh, I haven't been home a long time, 45 years, but... Uh, Things have changed a bit. Everything completely changed compared to the old days. Yes, sir. A little bit. Yeah, that damn uh, president, uh, you know, got a problem with the Iranian president uh, not acknowledging the uh, Holocaust there. Though. That's uh, not cool. That's not cool, right? That's not cool for us uh, Jewish people. It's not... Uh, You're not, Jewish? Not, yes. Huh. <laughs> Bobo, one more question. Bobo's oh, got Bobo, another question. Yeah, Bobo's got a question. raising his hand, so we figured we'd get one there, more. Bobo? Go ahead, yeah, well, Bobo. Well the, well, the other well, the other question I, I, I have to I have Could you to repeat ask. that, please? You know, oh. we... We should have a penis off because Bobo is hung too, like the Iron Sheik. Yeah. The Iron Sheik will not be dropping his pants yeah. on this. On this. Uh, what edition. if we turn off all the cameras? Because Bobo no, is uh, saying that he has a bigger penis no, than no, the Iron no, Sheik, and we all I know did, did how big is your penis, if Iron Sheik. Bobo wants to do it. That's fine. Three, the three, Iron Sheik is not uh, is not dropping yeah, his pants yeah, no, no, here. No, no, how no, big no, is your no, penis, no, Iron Sheik? Probably between ten to eleven. Ten to eleven inches. Right. But he's not. He's not going to. He's not going to show it today. No. Bobo, you. You better show that tremendous penis of yours. Uh, Iron Sheik, I know you're not gay, but you got to see what this Bobo is packing. You're not going to believe this one. You're not going to believe this. Bobo. Wait, wait. Show the Iron Sheik. All right, hold on a minute. Here's the big you want I have to get my photographer ready for this. So, uh, Could someone get uh, Bobo on mic as he shows the Iron Sheik what he's packing? You've never seen a, a bigger one in your life there, Iron not, Sheik. Not that, not that we actually want to look at this, but uh, Jesus Christ. I'm going to go fucking blind here. Oh, wow. <laughs> Jesus. All right, here we go. This is, this is Bobo showing what he's packing, right? Iron Sheik, you're into this, huh? I need a, we, need some, we need a girl in here right now. Iron yeah, Sheik, you're yeah. into this? This is too, much of a, this is too gay right you're, now. Yeah, exactly. This is, this is too much hey, of a... Oh, all right, Bobo's pulling down the ship. <laughs> oh, all right, Iron yeah, Sheik. You might like that. Iron Sheik, you comment on what you're seeing here. This is the uh, biggest I'm penis you're ever going to see. Ah. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> too fucking mad. <laughs> Iron Sheik's <laughs> laughing. Yeah, yeah, down, oh, down. Oh, 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 I want Iron Sheik to, to describe can what he's you, seeing here. Can you here. speak correctly? Oh, Bobo, can't, can't don't take that shit. shit. 
Bobo, keep the pants down. Keep the pants down and don't take that shit from him. Bobo, give him uh, some of your business. Yeah, they want you to put your pants by your ankle. So yeah. And, yeah. And, and stand closer together instead of spread out there. Right. Right? Yeah, better balance Here there. goes Bobo fuck. pulling his pants down. Aren't she, oh, uh, describe, oh, describe. Oh, describe. <laughs> I want you to go, like, trying to get you to go lower. And look at them, too. Let them, uh. No, let we've, them seen see that. Right. we've seen that. We've seen that. Iron Cheek, what are you, what are you looking at? What, what are you looking at? Do you have a shit stain in your underwear there? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> not that I'm looking, but the, Jesus fucking Christ. Iron Cheek, what are you looking at? Oh, I've seen like he said, Jesus fucking Christ, put your friend back in bed, you know. You embarrass <laughs> yourself. Uh, 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 Deeper, I'm like that from my you. pinky so is you. bigger. Jesus well, you know what? He's got a bigger cock than the iron sheet. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> oh, 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 no, oh, no, no. Iron sheet's oh, packing at 11. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. No, about, yeah, 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 what? I don't know about that. Ah. I'm, I'm not packing so, so much thanks to all the surgeries. I think I think it may have <laughs> what, affected What that. surgeries did you have? <laughs> Urinary system operation. How many? <laughs> Why? 40, they messed up an operation. It was an infection from an operation they messed up. How many surgeries did you have? It was 48. <laughs> because, all because of one infection. Because they left it open too long. Did it go to your brain? Forty-eight <laughs> surgeries. Fuck. It may have gone a little bit. So, yes, I can. Uh, I can see. What do you guys think? The other guys. What I do you think, think they're in shock. Are yeah, you in shock? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'll tell you, I, I live a sheltered life. <laughs> yeah, there's yeah. no need. Yeah, and I'm from Bush, down, Bush, I'm Bushwacker Luke has his back yeah. turned to the, to the guy, you know? <laughs> <laughs> and and hey, Bushwacker hey. Luke has his back turned. Yeah. Yeah. I should be scared of that one tonight. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> when the bushwhacker turns, turns his back, you know there's a problem. Hey, mate, there's a little sheep shag in there. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. all right, well, I think we did it all here, man. One more, uh, we got to do another plug yeah, of here? of course, of course. Of October course. 16th to 18th, that's today, for, uh, Saturday and Sunday. Big Apple Wizard World Convention, that's at Pier 94, that's 55th and 12th Avenue, New York City. And if you want to book the Iron Sheik, Axe and Smash of Demolition, Bushwhacker, Luke, or any of the other legends of wrestling, Go to www.esspromotions.com. That's esspromotions.com. And it ain't no BS. You just heard it from ESS. And also to the Eric's uh, birthday, I'd like to you guys tell him happy birthday. His birthday. Oh, uh, happy birthday. Wait, yeah. His birthday? Yeah, thank you. Yes, thank you. How old? Uh, 41. Jesus. Yes, wow, I'm, what are you doing? Yes, I'm old. Yes, it's been I'm a old. tough old fucking life, haven't <laughs> it? Uh, yeah, you are, he looks with the Iron Sheik for 20 years? No, kid, no kidding. Yes. Yeah, no, what no, the kid, fuck? No kidding. The Iron Sheik's draining <laughs> your youth. <laughs> Being the <laughs> place, no kidding. He's draining your youth. No, no kidding, yeah. Being when the fall guy for the Iron Sheik for 20 years, it does that to you. When did you say goodbye to the hair? What What age? What was shit. the Iron Sheik doing? About 20 years ago, What maybe? was the Iron Sheik doing when all your hair fell out in like one day? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> with the Iron Sheik, yeah, your hair has to fall out. I mean, hey, Sheik was making him humble. Yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Night together, and every other time you come in here, I've, are you gonna fuck him in the ass for his birthday, Iron Sheik? <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Uh, you yeah. said that last time that you would fuck him in the ass. No, I love that beer bag, that, beer, that Beck's beer bottle. You know. oh, but drink it, yes, no, no. Yeah. I'm engaged, so don't she go that likes, direction. Likes uh, a little beer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What a birthday I present! A, I enjoy a morning beer every so often. Yeah, was... It's usually after I've been up the whole night. Yeah, you know, it's hard to wake up and then you know crack a beer at ten in the morning. All right, uh, Sam, you're not going to get your he uh, your head licked, which sucks. Yeah, I don't think so. Can't you lick his head? Lick his head, Luke. Luke. Give him a good licking. Yeah, oh, no. Luke the Bushwhacker. Hey, 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 lick, 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 lick. Hey, 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 <laughs> if you can't get it together, Hulk well, Hogan the, and went will, silent for a second. Hulk Hogan will lick the head of your cock. <laughs> and that's what they uh, lick the uh, head of the cock. Bobo? <laughs> Bobo. Yeah, Bobo. What's up? Any Good. final thoughts? Anything Bobo, else? the, the Bushwhacker's doing some licking now. Bobo, come, come get one. Hey, hey. Bushwhacker's doing... Hey. But keep your pants hey, on, hey, damn mate, it. I'm not going down south. Damn it, keep, keep your pants on. I'm not going down south. Keep your pants on. Don't worry, I normally keep them on, all right? Yeah. Yeah. Normally. Right. Listen, you, listen, don't turn your back to the Bushwhacker, please. You want to get licked? Don't give him any ideas. I Bobo wants to get licked. I for this one, Mike. Duh. All right. My friend would be jealous I went to... All right, Luke is going to lick up, Bobo. Hey, mate. When did he last wash? Uh, when did you shower? 
uh, four no, days ago, maybe? No, I, I just... showered this morning, but earlier I rushed out of the bathroom. It was a bathroom that had a shortage of toilet paper. Oh, that's why the shit's stained? Where do you find these people? That hurricane. Hey, yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Where do you find these people? No, no, no it, was, it, was a bathroom in a, it was a bathroom in a train station, all right? Did Eric and Lori just you, say, where do you find do you these expect? people? Jesus yeah. Christ. Do you see who you hang out with? It's the same <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's the same shit. <laughs> you, see, you see the wrestling fans sometimes? What's wrong with you? Yes, Ooh. people who live in glass houses not only shouldn't throw stones, but should get dressed in the basement. <laughs> oh, it, oh, Jesus. It was a, it was a bathroom. You vaudevillian? It was a bathroom I went to in a train station, and there was a Sorted your toilet paper as you would expect right. in a subway station bathroom. So you yeah. have swamp ass right now? <laughs> Look like that. Yeah. You know, you know, when the bush is starting to move away from you, you know they got a problem yeah. there. You know? I, don't, I don't know if Luke wants to lick you, Bob. I don't think so, you know. I don't think it's going to happen. Uh, uh, that penis head of yours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's and packing, isn't he, Luke? Ah, uh, packing. <laughs> he packed and left. <laughs> All right. Well, well, I might have to see if that that whole Doctor Steve theory that Doctor Steve has actually works. What's that? No, I heard that theory that if you lose like a certain amount of weight, it can actually get bigger. I wonder if you lose enough, I can get the five inches. You could five, five inches. Five you could lose as much weight as Robert Reed. Happen, mate. All right. <laughs> you should hope for three. You could weigh as much as Karen Carpenter, <laughs> and you're still not going to get any bigger. Sorry to say. Maybe a penis pump. You're going to still be hung like an acorn. <laughs> yeah. All right, Sheik, any other thoughts? Did we do it? Oh, I'm happy to did see you guys and again. Very happy. Yeah. Pleasure. I hope I see you guys again in future. Pleasure right. for me. And are you Thank guys you coming to the Big Apple Wizard World Convention uh, oh, today over at the would, Pier 94? Wouldn't miss it. I didn't think you would. Wouldn't miss it. Yeah, we'll You're be going there. down there with You're, Sam. Yeah. Yes! Because Sam is a giant fan, too. Mm -hmm. Sam, you didn't ask any questions. You're the big wrestling guy. What, uh, we covered it all. I with see Sam yeah. at every wrestling convention no in the in, in the area. Of course you do. Yeah. Every everywhere yeah. he, we he go. He wants yeah. to be humbled someday. <laughs> so I'm not hoping. You don't want I to be take, humbled. I take care of Sam <laughs> at all the, all the conventions. Even the Big Apple. And Next you, week at the Legends of the you Ring like how uh, wrestling convention. Humbles people. I love how he humbles people. <laughs> it's <laughs> the best. I don't think uh, I'm being humble. And I'm we didn't get a camel clutch or nothing from Iron Sheik. I'm just going to ask her. We're lazy. They like being humble. No, 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 not today. No, you don't want. What do you mean not today? When when we supposed to do this. No, they want, someone wants to get in the, put in the camel clutch here. Yeah, what the fuck? Who, who got put in it last time? Uh, I did. You did. Who wants to go in at this time? Hey, Bobo! Bobo. No, hey. no, E-Rock, you want to you get camel clutch this time? How about Iron... Iron Sheik, let's I Sam. Want, I don't want Iron Sheik touching Bobo, please. No. How about no. Sam lays across his lap and Iron Sheik spanks him? No. That's not a good idea. No. What, what happened with that? <laughs> because it's no, there's no wrestling. Uh, here, likes little e Rock, you want to get, you want to be, you want to be camel clutched? <laughs> Come over here. All right, you e Rock. Come here, we got a camel, camel clutch. clutch. We'll do a camel clutch. And, and then, uh, Sam, you got to have a real question. No, I'm not going to okay. do it. You're the Iron Sheik. You're the master of the camel clutch. Nobody wants to see me put uh, anybody in a camel clutch. Come, Everybody come, wants to see you put me in a camel clutch, which is not going to happen. No, no, come down if you want to. How come E-Rock gets embarrassed when he can't think of okay, a punchline, but he's volunteering to get go camel clutch? Go, go on your hands and knees, but don't, yeah. but don't face Bobo, because he, uh, you know, knees. This, this is not how it's done. Yeah, nice and easy. Well, at, right. at this stage of the Iron Sheik's right. game, this yeah. is how it's done. Right. Right. Oh, he's humbling him. All right, he's easy, humbling nice him. Break his back. That's, yeah, there it yeah, is. Bubba, break wow, his back. I remember that one. Yep. Oh, I found out. Cap out, cap out. He doesn't know what to do. It was in the camel clutch. Yeah, that was, once that you're in crazy. that, once you're in that, it's over. Exactly. Oh, Thanks was... again, everybody. Have a good day. Well, thank you, Iron Sheik. All right, right, the Big Apple Wizard World Convention, Gentlemen. Pier 94, 55th and 12th Avenue. The demolition, Bushwhacker Loop, the Iron Sheik, and a bunch more. So show up. Hey, you guys got the, a great show here. Thanks for having us. Thank on. you, oh, sir. Thank you. We love pleasure it. having you on. Absolutely. The, the Iron Sheik demolition, the Bushwhacker, or any of the legends. Oh my God. Uh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Iron Sheik is uh, getting ready to leave. Great, Great to be here. Have a good day, mates. All right, Luke, can you, easy there. Can you lead everyone out with that, that famous walk of yours down the hall? Oh, We're going to film that. that. Thank you, sir. Thank Whoa. You. Whoa. Right, open the door. Get the curtains open. We want to see uh, Luke. Thank you so much. Lead this gang out of the studio with the famous walk. There he goes with the walk. Okay. All right. All right, there uh, they go uh, as they leave. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. 
Sir, security guy, you're, thank you. Very intimidating. I, I know you're intimidating, oh, but you can smile oh, once. Oh, look at Luke walking. Oh, I just licked Bobo. Oh, oh, this is crazy. Oh, no. He's going down the hall. Look at him. Oh, it's He's like 1987 all over again. And then he does. Oh, my God. Look at him working the camera. He's working the camera. Thank you, Eric the lawyer. Take it easy. Thanks for ruining another fine appearance by the Irish. <laughs> I heard that. Oh, sorry. And uh, there they go, walking slowly oh, but surely down the hall. Oh, what, what a fucking mess. What, what a cluster <laughs> fuck. <laughs> that whole scene. I don't even know what the fuck that was. Holy shit. <laughs> yes, Dude, Iraq. That is gold. <laughs> oh, you just wow. All right. How do you, how do you even explain that? It's just know. fucking. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! I remember watching the like I remember watching those guys yeah. in their prime. And what does Sam got? What's and then it's yeah, like I just watching him. He did the walk and he did the oh, you know, went right the, into the camera. Just like I was, a, I, I felt like I was a, a kid watching television again. Yeah, because you're looking through the viewfinder. Yeah. And it was like the TV when he walk walks up and goes, Oy! He used to do that to television cameras, and now he's doing yeah, it to no. actually your. My, old yes, camcorder. my old camcorder, <laughs> which is now used for the studio camera. Yes. Very Iron nice. Sh he talks a good game, considering he uh, walks with a cane. Uh, well, yeah. the cane, uh, he probably doesn't need it. It's probably to stretch out the assholes <laughs> before he humbles people. Yeah. For a guy that says he's not yeah, gay, he, he does a lot of ass oh, fucking. He loves just fucking his enemies in their assholes. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's accusing Hulk Hogan of fucking some fucking guy in the ass. And the Jesus. I, I had no idea that... B. Brian Blair from the Killer Bees was, yeah. not could have been, was, was, was. fucked in the ass by Hulk Hogan. <laughs> by Hulk Hogan. According we, to the Sheik. According. We have to say allegedly a lot today. Well, no, according to the Sheik, to him. it happened. Yeah. A lot of late breaking news on the show today. <laughs> Fucking. Um, that guy. And there was something else that came out of that, uh, that segment. Brooklyn Ace, what do you got? You're talking for a lot of people right now. Good morning, boys. Uh, Bobo, do you realize how sick you could get from shitting in a public restroom, a subway restroom? What are you doing shitting oh. in a subway bathroom, uh, Bobo? Everyone knows you shit before you leave the house if you have nowhere well, else to Well, I did to leave shit. the house, but I, I drank a lot of water. So you shit. And you shit? What are you, a bird? <laughs> no, it no. Comes no. out all in one fucking lump? No, I, I just ate something that must have caused it. I ate something that must have caused it. It gave me a tummy ache, and I couldn't see through my glasses. <laughs> and my ass neck hurt. Have a good weekend, boy. Thank you, sir. Take it easy. Maybe he ate some bad piss clams. Yes, some bad piss clams. <laughs> Ugh. Or get all the plugs in. I can't see, God, God damn it. damn it. So, uh, Bubba, why don't you got to trim that fucking nostril hair? <laughs> it is hanging out of your fucking nose. Is Do you bad? know your nostril hair hangs out of your nostrils? There's the mic over there. The mic is over here. Come here. Yeah. Come yeah. here. What's going on with your nose hairs? Yeah, Don't I know that. In I, the wait, mirror? I wait for it to get a certain amount of length. This way it could e easily be cut because I use like the, one of those small metal scissors. No, no. It's not supposed to come out of your nose before you cut it. <laughs> Look at it. You well, have it's... hair coming out of your fucking nose. Well, it's easier to see it when you're trying to cut it. You're trying to see what you're cutting. If it's too long, it is easier to see. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> he makes right. perfect sense. Yeah. yeah. Once you can see it, then he can see it. Then he can see it. Of course. Well, why didn't you clip it then in the subway bathroom while you were taking a <laughs> shit? <laughs> no, I didn't, I didn't do that in the subway bathroom. I, I How did you take a shit knowing there was no toilet paper? <laughs> well, there was, but there wasn't enough. <laughs> Wait a, a messy minute. Messy one. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. <laughs> How was there not enough? How did didn't you look and say, you know, I need a certain amount of paper? Sometimes I'm not, I'm not sure how much you're going to need. Like I'll go to a certain amount, and if I need more, I'll go to, I'll get more, I'll take more. So it was messy, and and you left a big skid mark there. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. Unfortunately. unfortunately, yeah, yeah, that sucks. I'm oh, sorry to hear that, Bobo. Uh, go, go clean up. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. It's Friday, and uh, yeah, and that's about the only reason I need to get the fuck out of here. I was able to get one of the videos up. Uh, Big A and Bobo doing the um, the abortion story. Yeah. Oh earlier. yeah. And then the fucking balloon boy story with Big A will be up later <laughs> on uh, my YouTube channel, OP Radio. I, I think the first one's up there. If it worked. <laughs> Holy cool. fucking! I'm exhausted good. from today. <laughs>
<laughs> Did that Iron Sheik thing sound like anything? Ah, uh, it's hysterical. That fucking Sheik, <laughs> when he's just fucking people in their assholes, <laughs> uh, it's it's a, it's astounding to me. Oh Love my it. God. All right. Love it. I think we did it all. Yeah, we did. Thanks Let's, for checking us out this week, guys. We'll uh, we'll see you Monday. Enjoy your weekend. Uh, I don't know. I might be at F.H. Riley's. That's my plug. 400 New York Avenue in the heart of Huntington Village. Maybe tomorrow night for the, the Islander game. The Compound Bar. Compound Bar. Yes. Nice. I'll be hanging. All right. Sam, any plugs? Just a Comic-Con. Special deliveries next week. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you're doing interviews down there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to interview. Believe it or not, I just booked an interview with... The Iron Sheik. Wow. No way. Yeah. Wow. I and one of the bushwhackers. Mm -hmm. Really? And demolition. Wow. Who was the Who was the security guy? He looked like he might have been an old wrestler. I look. At, he's his name. He wouldn't give me his real name. I don't even know how he got in the building. His name is huh. Miss. Oh. Mi <laughs> his name <laughs> is Mister. Mister E. Mr. E. Mr. E. See, it's Mister E. There's his card. He gave me his card. Oh really? Could you pop up a? picture of the fucking of demolition because i remember demolition and that guy from the old like days a that guy, guy looks like the guy that sells you insurance <laughs> right uh he, he also, does not look like no the demolition i remember he also played the repo man that's crush that's oh, not that's man. crush that's uh crush. You, you know you know danny i didn't how am i supposed to recognize <laughs> the guy 25 Sorry, years later exactly I, okay. I didn't recognize him at all Let's, uh, yeah, let's watch a Saw 6 commercial. Oh, oh great. God. Fucking Enough saw. with the Saw movies, yeah, all right? Really. Which one is he? No, those are the Road Warriors. Yeah. Those oh. are the killer. There's Demolition. There He's the is. one with the white, red, and black, not the silver. What are you talking about? The one on the right or the left, Sam? <laughs> Which one? My right or your right? <laughs> it's the same for you as it is <laughs> yeah. for us. We're, all We're looking, looking at, the at the same picture, <laughs> dumbass. on the right or the left? Do what? This one. With the long hair. On the right, this yeah. One, this on the right side. The right. That's the, that's the guy that that's was just the guy in? Was in here. Oh, yeah. oh, I think no, it's the other guy. Away. No, that's Smash. So how am I supposed to know that? No, nah, it looks like the other guy. He doesn't it's have his make the other guy. He doesn't have any makeup on, and it's twenty years later. That's who it is. He does when he does his appearances, though. Yeah. They put the makeup on, but he's bald. Right. Yeah, I noticed. So that. he's still. Uh, well, he should put a, like a little hair thing on. A little wig. Yeah. Why not? He also played the Repo Man. He looks like old Bill Deal down in <laughs> yes. first Central. That's what he looks like. <laughs> he did look like him a little yes. bit like fucking Wade. Good old Wade. We're not a bank, Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> That's who he looked like. He did. It was he driving me like, nuts. Like, 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 slightly, Wade. like a slightly younger version younger of Wade. Younger version of Wade. All right, now we got it. And that, and that was Luke. Uh, that was Luke of the Bushwhackers. I think okay. Butch is in New Zealand. Ah. Or do they still well, Luke's get the together? fun one anyway. Yeah, Butch doesn't. No, Butch doesn't do anything anymore. Are you gonna have an exclusive interview with Virgil? I'm hearing that uh, this is the time. Virgil. This time you're finally gonna get that interview. <laughs> Hanging out at the table all alone. Well, the I... problem is Virgil charges for everything at these conventions. Even for an interview. I'm sure that he would charge me if I asked to do an interview with him. Jesus. It's mic time, you fuck. That's why he doesn't. Well, look at his there's, table. There's yeah. nobody there. There's, there's a picture no that there. Danny pops up all the time. It's Virgil just sitting at a table by himself, waiting for someone to come up and ask for an autograph. And it, no one is because he charges. It's the best photo, I think, it's ever. It's such a sad photo. If you just go to Google Images and put in uh, Virgil signing. And Virgil it's a signing? wrestling superstar. <laughs> you can't put WWE, WWF, right. nothing. It's just Virgil. Yeah. And he's completely alone. Oh, God, Vance, give these guys some money. They made you a billionaire. I did enough for them. They could kiss my ass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're babbling now. Yeah, let's get the fuck and out. And have a good weekend. I'll see yep, you Monday. Absolutely. Everybody else, have a good weekend. <laughs> and thanks for the support. Bye-bye. I want to say hello to the, all my intelligent radio station fans, Opie and Anthony. And I want to say thanks to them. Jesus or Muhammad or Allah to have come to the most famous city in the world, like Fred Sinatra said. The city never sleep. The city is up all the time. Manhattan, Madison, City Garden, New York, and especially Opie and Anthony, radio station. I love all my wrestling fans, and I love all radio station people listen. Anthony and Opie, Opie and Show. Number one in the world from A to the Z. If you cannot make it, New York, 
You don't make it nowhere. Like Frank Sinatra said, the city never sleep. You cannot make it New York. You don't make it nowhere. God bless Frank Sinatra, my Italian fazal. He used to come watch my match in the garden. And he was the real, real singer and her class and part of mafia. God bless you. Well, you find time about FH rallies, though. I appreciate that, my friend. I see you tweeting about FH. Mm. Brother appreciates it. Still driving the cab? Uh, uh, yes, but the business is real slow. So. <laughs> business is slow, huh? Yeah. Why is that? Uh, I guess, you know, uh, bad financials. What? And... was breathing like that. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> You Those hear big that? juicy lips of Bobo. <laughs> He's trying to get Bobo angry. is breathing like What's a What's wrong fucking... with your breathing? I thought it was Big A, but it's definitely Bobo. Like the no, fucking not, T-Rex. Not, not, I, don't think, I don't think I'm breathing heavy. I can hear it in the microphone. Yeah. I heard... Yeah. No, 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 that's, just, that's just my nose here. I'm quiet. <laughs> it's your nose hairs? No, it's my nose. It's, it was breathing through my nose. Oh, well, I heard it on the on the mic. <laughs> very, very, fun, very funny. I, uh, I didn't even realize I was breathing that heavy. Very funny. Oh, it's, not very it's, funny. It's, this thing damn Disturbing. picks up everything. What the big honker of yours? No, no. This thing picks up just even the slightest breathing. What? What thing? Oh, the microphone. Yeah. Very sensitive. Yeah, very sensitive. So, sure. Big A, uh, what uh, uh, th that cab thing? How do people get it? Do they hail you? Do they hold up their hand and go taxi? Actually, they call my company. The oh. company dispatches out the calls. And uh, you're not getting that many calls? Uh, I've been kind of slow. Yeah? Lately, yeah. yeah and making ends meet, though? Yeah. Paying the barely. bills? Able to pay the bills? Yeah, just barely, yeah. Just barely. Are you going to find another job? Um, uh, I was thinking about it, about how many jobs out there because uh, a lot of people are losing their jobs all over the place. Right, right, right. So Obama will help you. Yeah. Obama will <laughs> help you. He's going to give you a handout. You're yeah. you're an Obama supporter, right? <laughs> no, huh? Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> he's, he's just laughing. He's just giggling. You don't there. like Obama? Is it because he's a, uh, a uh, you know, you know. A Democrat? Yeah. <laughs> maybe you could go down to the uh, maybe you could go down to the UN and become a, a translator. Yeah, that could be possible. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> maybe I'll translate Iron Sheik. Oh, yeah. are you guys fans of the Iron Sheik? <laughs> yeah, of course. I always. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Bobo. yeah. He, 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 that guy brings so much entertaining moments to the show. He's been on our show twice in two years. <laughs> Yeah, but during but during those during those two times, he's always yeah. He, he, the the guy's always an entertaining character. My brother does a good impersonation. Wait, 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 wait. You're saying that you asked her on a date to see Jim Norton at the Stress Factory? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, well, wow. well, I, I know she likes Jimmy, and I know she enjoys Jimmy's comedy. Who doesn't? And you like Jimmy? Yeah, of course. Jimmy's great. Oh, oh okay. Mm-hmm. And is it true uh, your uncle works at the Queen's Motor Inn? Yes, that's right. He works in the Queen's Motor Inn, but unfortunately, uh -huh. he's not sure he can get he can get discounts or anything like oh. that. I, I I asked I asked my uncle. I fig I figured that that that's why I actually an invite invite that that's why I remember that time I said that about Christina. That I bring well, her out to the yeah, Queen's yeah, Motor Inn. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I. What happened mm. was I I asked my uncle. Can he get me a discount? He says, "Oh, I'm not sure sure about that." Right, right, right. He could right. get me a discount. I was thinking maybe he could get me some kind of discount uh -huh. since he works since he works there. You think he would? And with all the exposure on the show, you're getting recognized now. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's uh, right. I, I've got it. I've got it stopped on the on the subway. Uh huh. I think once I got I got stopped on uh I forgot uh, around around my block of my one of my one of my neighbors knows realized I was on the show. You're getting recognized in your neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, exactly. There's actually mm. someone in my neighborhood that actually knows me. That, did, that knows I, me from the show. From the show? Yeah. Have you been recognized at a Mets game? 
Yeah, I I have been. Uh huh. Yeah. Do you wear anything uh, that people would like recognize you for, or they just know you from your voice? And sometimes they sometimes they seem. Sometimes I think I don't know. Like one person heard my voice. Then maybe I was wearing I was wearing a I was wearing a, a serious hoodie one time. Now you always wear Mets uh, logo stuff, right? Uh, not all the time. There's at the a game, lot, I mean. A, at the game, of course. <laughs> at the game, of course. <laughs> I suck at this. <laughs> <laughs> well, we haven't seen you in a while, Bobo. Yeah, yeah. It's been a while. It's been a while, right? Yep. Uh, Tim in Boston, what's up? I want to tell Bobo how compelling he is on the radio and how much I, I just love it when he comes on and yeah. the show great. Yeah, you really do a good job for us, uh, Bobo. All right, that's good to know. And we thank you. All right. Someone's saying if you wear a shirt that says, Hi, I'm Bobo, <laughs> that would be uh, pretty silly. <laughs> and yeah. Are you are you uh, fighting with a fake Bobo on Twitter? Yeah, there is a fake Bobo. Oh, a guy that says right. I am the. Too. There's a guy that says I am the real Bobo on Twitter. Uh oh. So what I'm gonna do to finally give him some good proof that that Mister Met Eight in fact is the real Bobo, I am gonna tweet a picture of me actually on Twitter, and they'll see a, an evidence of me in front of the screen. Hopefully with right. they'll see when, when Derek sits in a room for eight hours a day with no windows, you yeah. always get something good. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> well, we got Big A too. D boy, ready to do the news. Uh, Big A is lumbering down the hallway right now. Wow. When he walks down the hall, he walks down the hall wall to wall. He is just a big man. And uh, wow, look at Bobo. We haven't seen him in such a long time. Yeah, get Bobo in here first. Hi. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Bobo. It's a Bobo. He's Hi, got Bobo. A, uh, let me let me just uh, describe um, what we're looking at here. Bobo has a uh, hat on. It's a serious uh, little doggy hat that has a uh, NASCAR uh, flag, uh, you know, the old finish line right. flag in its mouth. And then we're looking. You have a race collection, uh, Gordon Twenty Four Performance Leader Dupont uh, shirt. I guess that's Jeff Gordon. Yeah, yeah, that's correct. That you, that's correct. Uh, anything on the back of that shirt? No, there's Just nothing on the back. Of, there, there's nothing on the back of the shirt. Black it's, jeans or something? Yeah, yeah, those are black jeans and uh, white uh, sneakers. So that is what Bobo looks like, and of course, his patented Bobo glasses. And Bobo, uh, you're a Mets fan. Y yeah, that's right. Thing. Uh, mm. Yeah. Um, now, uh, wow. A Mets fan. That's got to suck. So you're a Mets fan? Yeah, that, yeah, that's right. Uh, I, I don't, I don't even look at the playoffs when they don't make it. Right. Really, you're not going to watch the Yankees? That's terrible. No, no I'll, 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 gl I'll glance, I'll, I'll watch the game. But if I'm, but if there's something else I want to watch on at the same time, I'll, uh, I'll watch that instead, instead of, instead of DVR it oh. at the same time. Well, you're from New York. I, I, I do, I do pay attention are to the you game. Are you from New York? Yeah, I do. I, oh. I, I, I do. <laughs> I do gotta, pay attention to the games. And if, 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 if I got, uh, if I got, if I got a yeah, friend whoa. of mine, if, if there's a friend of mine that, a friend of mine that maybe some friends that are Yankee fans, I, I've congratulated them when they've won the series. Bobo, yeah. so you are a NASCAR fan. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. All right, mm -hmm. NASCAR fan. And is Jeff Gordon uh, your favorite? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've wow. a, I've actually attended uh, two races already. Oh, you have? Yeah, Homestead in 1999, first race at the Homestead Miami Speedway. Yeah. And Bobo, you have a sister. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, she has a dog. E yeah, she has a dog. Oh, all right. So, okay. Uh -huh. And you live in Queens. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Uh -huh. Well, we're just trying to get some of this out there for the listeners that haven't heard you yet. You know, you're a big star, but there's still a lot of people that don't know yeah, go a much about you. Yeah, biography. Yeah. And you have a major crush on Christina? Yeah, 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 that, yeah that's right. Yeah, that's right. I even invited her to go with me to, to see uh, Jimmy at the Stress Factory in November. Oh, is she going to go with you? Well, she said, "Let her let her know the day the day." You like I got evidence it, I got that I voted. So, this so to help you out, if uh, if people are following you on Twitter, I am the real Bobo. You're gonna have a picture of yourself, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. My Twitter account is Mister Met Eight. 
Oh, that's the fake guy. So you're I am the well. You're obviously I am the real Bobo. No, no, no I am the real Bobo is a fake is a fake it, it, imposter. But he says I am I'm the, the real, real Bobo. Bobo. So that's got to be the real Bobo. Yeah, and he's it, got a picture it, of himself. Yeah, and he's got he, a picture. He, he, is it, and a wow, you. and a wow logo, which means that's yeah, 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 but that's that, that, you. that guy took my that guy stole my picture. You're lying. I'm not. Li I'm not lying. No, you are lying. I'm not lying. Because that's what celebrities do. They say I am the real, and then whoever it is, yeah. Yeah, just to yeah, prove yeah. to everybody that exactly. they're the real yeah. celebrity and not yeah. the fake celebrity. Twitter yeah, but account. the thing is, they got. So that's good. Th yeah, but the thing is, they got to remember there was all, before when I first o opened that Twitter account. What? When I first opened my Twitter account, I did not. There was only one person that knew me as Bobo at the time. Oh, and who was that? That was my sister. Your, your sister. sister calls you Bobo? She was the only one who knew me by that name. Does your sister call you Bobo? Yeah, she does. She's called me oh, that since she was a baby. Well, it's pretty smart that you you, you got a new account and says I'm the real Bobo. That, 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 puts actually, a, that puts an end to the whole I, I, you know, actually, that's controversy. Not, that, that, that's not you are even, over. You won, my friend. That, I am the real Bobo. we got to promote the that, shit that, out of that. That, that, that. That's not even my Twitter that, account. That, 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 who the heck is this imposter that's been putting up this stuff well, on uh, Mr. Met 8? Yeah. No, 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 no. Mr. Met 8 We're is have actually it all my Twitter. Out today, though, which is good. So. No, no, Mr. Met 8 is actually my Twitter account. Yeah. Yeah. All right. M M Mr. Met 8? Yeah, yeah, that's my Twitter account. Oh, so oh, I understand. A lot of people have two Twitter accounts, so that's when yeah. you're just talking Met shit. But for all the other Bobo stuff, I am the real Bobo. No, no, I got it. We're, we're no, all set. Now. No, there's a guy. There's all right, a guy, let's bring a Big A in here. Me. Uh, thank you, Bobo. That's great. You're going to help us out with the news today, Bobo? Yeah, I am. All right. You, you got some opinions on Balloon Boy and all that? Yeah, I... I all I, right. I, save it for when we get to that story, my friend. And here he is, ladies Big and a, gentlemen. Good to see the diet's working, uh, my brother. Big A. Big A in studio. It's been a while. How are you, Big A? Oh, hi, Opie. Not yeah. bad. Yeah. Hi, Anthony. How you doing? Hi. Very, very well. Uh, okay. Good to see you again. See you um, too again. Nice to have you here in the studio. It's been quite a while. What have, what have you been up to? Um, just working and, and hanging out. Nothing much. Yeah, I just working, is, hanging out. I what is, is, I, as Bobo, but I try. Yeah. Ah, what, so what have you been doing? How you been hanging out? Where you been going? And uh... um, um, not too many places. So I work at night, so I really, it cuts my hanging out time. Ah, the Red Hot Chili Peppers, huh? It's uh, Friday, Opie and Anthony, thanks for checking us out. This is a busy show. Uh, we're going to have more audio of Jill talking about you Ant, in a few minutes. Why? What happened? Uh, that's just breaking right now. Is that just breaking right now. They're cutting it up down the hall. Also, uh... More on Balloon Boy, the Iron Sheik. He's got some questions to answer today, my friends. Allegations. Allegations of, of what? Child molestation by another wrestler. And some uh, crack smoking. Yeah. Also, uh, there was something else, something else. Oh, yeah, Big A and Bobo are going to be coming in in a minute or two. Okay, good. Um, Sorry, I'm, my last bite of my bagel. It's all right. It's all Fucking right. Mm -hmm. We found something out about Bobo, a new one, a new tick he has. If you say anything that's true to Bobo, he'll go, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. So we want to see how many times we can get him to say, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. What's an example? Like you ask him. Uh, hey, Bobo, are you a Mets fan? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do you like Christina? Yeah, that's right. Or I should be saying you like Christina. Yeah, all right. Yeah, that's right. Right, okay. And every time we get him to do that, we'll hit the the old bell so you can play along at home. You can uh, even Steve you can Bay even Sh ring a fake bell if you're in yeah. your car, like ding. Steve from Bay Show is saying, hey, Bobo, you got fucked by your brother. Yeah, yeah that's, that's right. right. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> he doesn't know we're saying this right now, so. No. He's, because as soon as he... he he's is in a, a soundproof booth. Well, as soon as he's aware of a bit, you know, he's so smart that he just, like, blows the bit. He wrecks it. He tries to do it too hard. Right. Uh, 
uh, Puddle of AIDS writes, it's Jocktober. I don't even know if we're going to get to Jocktober today. Uh, he writes, the Light FM 106.7 here in New York City. Question of the day. Ready for this question of the day? A big radio station here in New York City. Don't just, even tell me. It's just asked. That question. It's not, unfortunately. Oh, that would have been a good one. Yeah. Uh, After a breakup, what's the number one thing <laughs> right. that uh, 99% of the people do? <laughs> uh, burn. Burn, burn clothing. Clothing in a fire pit <laughs> while the guy that's supposed to protect the man is videotaping it. <laughs> yes, that was a correct answer. <laughs> Puddle of AIDS. Uh, this question was just asked on a big radio station. Mm. Women do this once a week, but dread it. Hmm. We're not giving dread the answer. It. I'm not mm. giving the fucking answer. Let me think. Um, I'm not giving the fucking answer. I could give a shit. Yeah. Uh, tickle their uh, clit with a rake. What? <laughs> tickle their clit with a rake. <laughs> I, uh, we should get Bobo and Big A in here. Is Bobo ready to go? Ah, uh, Big A. In like a minute. I think he's just wrapping up with Derek in production right now. What are they doing in production? Anything good? Probably. <laughs> Probably. Isn't it all?